Yes, I did it. Hey, fun fact. Um, I just created. I just created the nightmare soundboard sound. Um, within the past like three or four minutes of that last song playing during the starting soon screen, <laughs> I literally I created the whole thing. I went to YouTube, downloaded the video, uh, cut it together put it in stream deck and then as yeah some some of y'all might as a little tease i i kind of i needed a moment to like figure out if it sounded good enough and so i paused the song at like an opportune moment through through a nightmare in there and then kept the song playing <laughs> before the pickup um just to see that like both gave me an opportunity to listen to it and see if it sounded good and then also um i don't know i guess do something funny Nightmare. Volume's good. The cut I feel like actually could be better now that I listen to it. What about fade out? Nightmare. Hmm. The fade out is too short. I don't know. I'll have to I'll have to re-edit it maybe. But um as it is, it's fine. Nightmare. Then again, I feel like I feel like the reason I don't I don't particularly like it is is because people people start laughing at the tail end of his of his nightmare. <laughs> it's like he's walking out of the room. <laughs> yeah, he goes. He... <laughs> nightmare. <laughs> That's fucking Yoshi P after his last interaction with you. Nightmare. That's right. He's walking away from you. Oh shit. Oh no. That's so mean. Nightmare. Cool. Um, well, we have a nightmare button now. Hi, everybody. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Uh, it's, uh, it's, um, Penny, don't play for 15 minutes. I want a proper shower speed run. Okay. I mean, I usually don't play for 15 minutes at least, but now, now, now that you've told me not to do it, ooh, that rebellious spirit in me is kicking, kicking right up. Oh, I might just go ahead and start just because you told me not to do something. Um, no, in all seriousness, though, welcome uh, to the Tuesday stream. Um, we're going to do God of War, which is normally the Wednesday stream, but it's not tonight because it's Tuesday, if you can imagine. Um, I was I was torn between... I was torn between either starting. I was I was gonna maybe try Pentiment. Um, if you don't know, Pentiment is a new um game from Xbox Game Studios and uh, Obsidian specifically. Um, and I'm a I'm a big fan of Obsidian. Uh, as a studio, I think they're doing a lot of cool stuff. I mean, I I fucking loved uh I loved the Outer Worlds. Um, I haven't played a lot of Grounded, but it seems like it's pretty cool for those who, who it's, like, up, up their alley for. Um, what else? Um, I appreciate Fallout New Vegas, of course, from a, from a writing perspective, uh, when I know of it. And, um, I definitely am excited about, you know, Outer Worlds 2 and, um, Avowed, specifically. Um, those are like some, those are some games I'm like extremely looking forward to. Um, so all in all, I'm, I'm just like, I'm just really into like what Obsidian has going on lately. I feel like they are kind of a, a sleeper hit kind of studio right now. Um, and Pentiment, uh, is like this new kind of like 2D, like, like heavy story and high, uh, story and dialogue heavy uh, RPG that, like, takes place in, like, medieval times, and it's all in, like, a medieval kind of, like, art style. Um, and presentationally, it looks super cool, but also, apparently, uh, it's awesome. It's, uh, it's apparently awesome. It's been, uh, it's been getting great reviews, like, fucking, like, nines and tens, basically, across the board. Um, so I wanted to try that. I, like, obviously, that's, you know, given everything that's already going on, I can't, imagine that's going to be something I do a full playthrough of unless it like really like grips me. Um, but I was thinking about trying that tonight, but then ultimately I was like, here's the thing. I'm, la I'm lagging behind so badly with God of War. I'm lagging behind so badly. 
Um, also, yeah, Baldur's Gate 3 actually was something I was considering streaming, and I still am. It would definitely, Baldur's Gate 3 would be something I would just, like, toss in, like, casually. That's another one of those where it's like, I unfortunately don't think I can prioritize a Baldur's Gate 3, like, series or, like, full-length playthrough or whatever, but, like, um, you know, every so often I'll be like, oh, I feel like one day I'm gonna stream this. Like, <laughs> like it's one, it's one of those games where it's like, someday... Someday I'm going to get to it in one way or another, whether it's just like an impression stream or whether it's like a full thing. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's from the same devs uh, who did Divinity Original Sin 2, which I haven't played the full thing of, but I've played about like 30 to 40 hours of Original Sin 2. And I fucking love it. I fucking love it. That's 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 like a that in Baldur's Gate are like their backlog games for me that I'm like. I can't go the rest of my life without finishing those at least once. Um, and Divinity especially, because uh, I just I just adored that game. Um, I played most of it. The problem is that I played most of it on, on PS4 for some reason. Like, I put a lot of time into Divinity Original Sin 2 on PS4. And it was a good version of the game. Don't get me wrong. It, it, it's not like it was a bad version of the game. I mean, I wouldn't have put as much time into it if it was a bad version, but... You know, nowadays, there's plenty... Of, like, I mean, it's on fucking, like, iPad. Obviously, the PC version is, like, the best way to do it. Um, but I think the reason why I elect to play so many games on console um, when the version is good enough and when it's not an FPS, and sometimes even when it is an FPS, is really just because, like, for some reason, I feel like with a console, it's just so much easier for me to really sink into a game. Um, like... I, I, and I think the, the reason why that's the case is, is a lot of sort of little nuances. One, I like playing games with a controller when it's better to do so. Um, I also really like the, you know, the, like obviously the ability for consoles to plug into a TV, like, and, and, you know, like the, the couch play experience for PC, um, I mean, with Steam Deck and stuff nowadays, that's kind of changing, but Overall, obviously, you know, consoles are designed for couch play and the like. Um, and ultimately, they just excel at that just sort of plug and play experience so much more. And I don't know. I mean, I grew up playing consoles nonstop. And it's just like it, it's it's very it's a lot easier for me to spend time in a game if it's on console. However. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's kind of, I, I was just, I played Divinity Original Sin on PS4, and I was like, oh, this is great. Um, and it kind of just made it so much easier for me to put in the hours that I did. But unfortunately, eventually I got distracted, as I do with a lot of games. Um, but then, ever since then, I've just been like, fuck, I need to go back. And the thing that really excites me about divinity specifically is just that it's like a co-op rpg as well you can play like the whole campaign multiplayer um which i've done a little bit and it's a great time it's so fun uh but like but then you know the double-edged sword about that is that it's such a long game you know it's this like massive rpg in order to do a full playthrough co-op it takes the kind of scheduling prowess and consistency of planning and social energy that I just do not have. <laughs> but ideally, I'd love to do a co-op playthrough. Um, me and my friend Typho have, I feel like, been wanting to do like a Divinity co-op playthrough for like, upwards of like five years at this point, I feel like. Um, and then I also played a little bit with Joy one time. And I think that was maybe on stream. Maybe. I think she may have streamed it on her end. What's that snapping sound in the background? Oh, shit. Sorry. That's my coffee. That's my coffee cup. <laughs> uh, it, has a, it has a little, um, it has like a little pop tab kind of thing that opens and closes the sip part that you sip out of. Um, and I, 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 I like fidgeting with it. I don't know. I do it. Kind of without realizing it. I, I keep forgetting it comes up on the mic. Because I've heard it before. And I apologize. Um, Baldur's Gate definitely feels a, more casual, simplified than Divinity Original Sin. But it's probably because I'm more familiar with the D&D &D system. I, mean, 
I mean, I don't feel like that would make sense either way. Like, I feel like one, you know, familiarity breeds a sort of illusion of simplicity, but also on top of that, um, Baldur's Gate, I imagine, is going to have a little bit of a wider audience than Divinity, given it is D&D branded. Whereas Divinity is like, fully original you know so it's it's a little bit more niche just by design because like who out there is like because you know if someone's like someone's first isometric crpg if there's a good one out there it's probably gonna be D related you know um just given that's such a massive like that's like that's like baby's first rpg like across the board um specifically in the ttrpg and CRPG space, I imagine. I actually like the snapping. It's kind of calming. Cool, because I guarantee you, I'll forget I'm doing it at some point. You'll hear it again. <laughs> ASMR stream. Hey, if it counts, I'll, I'll take it. I'm not even, like, it, it makes it easy for me. I can brand it as ASMR. And then, um... Not even have to put the effort in. That's a free audience. <laughs> add the tag. No, I'm not gonna add the tag. <laughs> Here, here's a here's a couple for you just for the just for the Can you hear that can you hear the ice? It's cool. <laughs> like it's actually, that's actually like that's actually a nice sound. I think from my end it is. Yeah, it's got like a. Except it doesn't sound like that at all. Cam back, Penny. You can start playing the game now. Okay, well then I'm not even gonna. I'm. Hey, sorry guys. I have to cancel God of War this stream. <laughs> I can't play it anymore. Someone told me to. I'm having a crisis. Look, I bought blue eyeliner. Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> Sorry, I started scrolling through Tumblr and I <laughs> started playing a video I recently reblogged. AIA. Look, I bought blue eyeliner. Oh man. Sorry, I need to close Tumblr. I need to close. I, I have Tumblr and Twitter open and it's dangerous. I'm gonna keep <laughs> Hey girlies. Hey girl hey girl hey 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 girlies. I have a phantom pregnancy. Oh my god. <laughs> Milk party. <laughs> I'm not going. <laughs> Sorry, it's, it's, a, it's a video. It's a video. If you go to my Tumblr, it, it, it's someone was just like, this is a conversation we actually had in my group chat of mostly women. And it was just like text to speech voice the entire time. Milk party. I'm not going. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Um, so last time. Last time in God of War <laughs> Ragnarok. We, we found Tear, which is crazy. Um, and many tears were shed. <laughs> um, and... We we found we found a very good stopping point. I'm actually I'm person I'm quite proud of my my ability to push through until the perfect stopping point last time because now I feel like now I feel like we're just hopping right into a new episode. You know? Yeah, we also found Mamir's dirty laundry. We found um 
Uh, we found a lot of atrocities that Mimir committed in the past, which was um, a little yikes, adjust my collar. Uh, uh oh. Uh, but that's okay because he's a different person than he was two seconds ago. I'm not the same man I was two minutes ago. Um, and yeah. Yeah, it was a little problematic. He chained up a big whale and um, encouraged a bunch of uh, dwarves to uh, let, like, I think Odin and Odin's lackeys, like, install mining rigs <laughs> in their home that I'm sure have just been uh, compromising. I'm sure they've just been compromising the environment the entire time. Really, you talk about the normalization of tying up a whale. Yeah, it's insane. Most people are not willing to really look deep in inside their hearts and fix their problematic behavior. So instead, we just ignore it and we say, well, everyone does it. Yeah, we also introduced slag moments, um, which I'm, I, which I'm, I'm sunsetting this stream, okay? Because I got the impression we're gonna be hearing the term sl slag way too many times. I mean, if, if hey, you know what? Never mind. Here, if y'all want to continue to pop off about hashtag slag moments, then please feel free. I will not, I will not stop you. I don't know if I can do another fan cam though. One, just because I feel like the bit is, the bit probably like reached its heights for me in terms of what I can do on stream. Um, and also, uh, playing Numa Numa uh, demonetized my vlog <laughs> for part two. <laughs> and it was worth it. It was worth it. Don't get me wrong. Um, I usually don't mind stuff like that just because I've, I, 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 would, I would rather there be a, like the funniest fucking moment ever that I don't get money for rather than like being paid for not doing anything interesting. Um, <clears throat> but <laughs> Jesus Christ, sorry. I don't know if y'all, I don't know if y'all can hear joy in the background. She is, uh, she's going crazy right now. Uh, she's been streaming for two days and there's five more to go. If you enjoyed slag moments, maybe support the stream. It's true. It's true. It's true. Uh, subs are appreciated. Donos are appreciated. All the all all the like. Yeah. If y'all don't know, uh, my partner Joy, um, who I who I love so much and live with, uh, is currently streaming for seven days straight. <laughs> It's a it's a big she's doing a big event stream right now uh called No No Pokemon Left Behind. And um she's like catching all of the remaining Pokemon that she has to have to to get like like a fucking fully complete Pokedex. Um and specifically from like extremely I guess like old games that are like hard to get or access uh legally. And she's doing so legally. Um, so yeah, so she's kind of she's kind of going crazy right now. Um, and she's playing up to she's playing up to seven days, and she's going to also play the release of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, which I am also going to play uh on release. So we're gonna have a lot of a lot of Pokemon energy in this house when that day when that day comes along. Um oh, she is like she's very highly prepared for the task. Um, she's, she like literally is taking like long dedicated breaks and just keeping the stream up and live and having like somebody on call, oh, uh, she calls the Lavender Tower crew. Um, and, um, you know, she has like, like actual like day-to-day -day life obligations that, She's still managing to like take care of, which is sick as fuck. <laughs> but like, goddamn, I, ooh, 
I still can't imagine how how mentally taxing it's going to be by the end of it. Um, but you know, it's fun. It's a fun time. Have you decided what start who your starter will be? Um, I honestly, I thought I was either going to go with Fue Coco or uh, Sprigatito. Um, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. I actually think I'm going to go with Quaxley. Like, I think, I genuinely think that's, that's going to be my go-to. I watched, um, because I, I watched Arlo's recent video about picking his starter. And, uh, it was, it was very great because it actually helped me nearly as much as it helped him. Um, because we were in the same boat where it was like, oh, God damn, like, I don't dislike any of these starters, but all of them are equally good. And there are things that I both love and kind of don't like about all of them. So it's like, it was like so fucking hard for me to decide. Um, but the thing is, when he was going over Quaxley in, um, when he was going over Quaxley in the video, I just kept thinking like, dude, I love ducks. <laughs> like, I fucking love ducks. I don't like his hair so much. And I'm a little scared because his hair is probably going to... And obviously, I know I know there have been leaks and stuff. Please, 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 I am begging you, do not tell me or imply anything. If you have seen the Starter Evolution links, leaks, do not tell me. Do not imply or tell me anything about information from those leaks. I don't want to see it. However, um, I was going to say, the hair is like... Um... No, we didn't forget about Joy. We just wish her well and we're moving on because she she's an adult that can do what she wants. <laughs> she's having fun, so why the fuck not? Um, the hair bothers me and I am almost entirely confident that it's going to be like a big focus of all of his evolutions. But like, he's just a funny little duck. You know, he's got the beak and he goes quack, quack, probably because he's a duck. And I like ducks. I just started thinking about how much I like ducks and I started thinking about Daffy Duck and I was like, oh, Daffy Duck is like one of my favorite fucking fictional characters of all time. Daffy and Donald Duck. Oh, yeah, I guess he's more Donald, but you know. Um, I don't know. My brain completely died. <laughs> I started singing Carly Rae Jepsen for a second. Um, I completely lost my train of thought. I'm getting distracted tonight. I'm very easily distracted today, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I should. I feel like I should be drawn towards Sprigatito because, you know, kitty cat. But like, let me be honest, I just really don't like how green Sprigatito is, you know? Like, I just, I, I don't like the green. I'm, I'm never the biggest fan of grass type starters anyway. But, like, it is entirely impossible to ignore how grass starter Sprigatito is when, when they're so green, you know? It just doesn't, it just doesn't appeal to me. I don't like that. I don't like the color palette. I like the model, and I like how Sprigatito looks. I don't like the color palette. I think that's really it. I think, that's, I think that's literally the only reason I am not fully settled on Sprigatito. Because obviously, like, you know, I don't mind that Sprigatito is actually, like, a grass starter in terms of mechanics. I just don't like the green. Um, and then I love how fucking cute and weird Fue Coco is. But also, Quaxley's a duck. So I think I'm going to go Quaxley. I've been, I've been very confident in my decision on Quaxley. Cause I'm like, oh hell yeah, I could play through. I could play through Pokemon Scarlet and have a little duck friend. And then I'm sure there will be like plenty of other 
new designs that are, you know, that'll kind of fill in the void. I, I love Fue Coco. I think Fue Coco is super cute. Apparently Fue Coco is like supposed to be like a pepper. But I'm with Arlo in that I just can't unsee an apple. I sw I swear to God, Fue Coco like looks like an apple. <laughs> I can't I can't unsee it. It, yeah, no, a pepper makes more sense when you hear it because it's like, oh, yeah, like fire type. Also, you can kind of see pepper in the design, but like once you see apple, it's like it's really hard to not see apple for some reason. Yeah, I know, and they even they they put him next to an apple. Which was like I don't know what they were trying to do there. They really, they just confused a whole generation of people. Like, yeah, oh my god, yeah. Like, like his coloration and his face, like, and also the shape, like the top of his head, the way it's shaped, like, look, look, look at this, hold on, hold on. You see? <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Okay. Look at that. Look at how apple shaped that is. And like apple shaped and colored. The color is exact. He's got the stem at the top. And it's like, yeah, that's that's. But then you also look at it, and knowing it's pepper, you can you can see. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah, totally. I I, I can see pepper. But I don't know. Apple is apple is always the first thing I think. I I yeah. I really do think it's the it's the it's the the coloration of the face and the way that the shape happens at the top. I think that that was like a. That was kind of the nail in the coffin for this design. Anyway, yeah. Um, <clears throat> so I think it's going to be Quaxley for me. Uh, I'm, I'm excited either way. And you know what? Here's the thing. If I go with my decision and in game, I just hate it. Like I just fully regret it, which I doubt. But just in case, I can always just start over. I don't care, you know. Why not? Can I'm I'm legally allowed to do it? Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh God, I want to play more God of War. <laughs> let's, let's do it. Oh man, um, did y'all see the new fucking Elgato announcement today? I am so, I am so viciously excited about, about the fucking Stream Deck Plus. I'm not gonna lie. I, I ordered it immediately. And it's probably going to replace my Beacon Mix Create and also... I'm I'm gonna have to rebuild my entire audio setup again for it, but I don't care because it it looks incredible, and I, I just can't stop thinking about it. I can't stop thinking about it. I'm so excited about it. It's so cool. Not sponsored, not sponsored, but still. I just I don't know. Like I've just I've been like. I love how you said that. Like Elgato is like the biggest news in gaming. I, it, 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 they are for me, you know, constantly. Like I fucking, I love Elgato. Here's the thing, genuinely. And I, and I, like, I again, not sponsored. I have never had any official contact with Elgato at all in my entire life. But here's the thing: is that I, I'm just such a big fan of of like all their stuff. And like you know me, like I've talked about, like I love 
equipment and I love like cool new like stream and like creative tech and stuff and that's like their whole thing and like I have been a fan of Elgato since the first game capture like the first game capture HD the one that looked like a like a weird cylinder like a kind of a flat cylinder and you had to have like the special cord to record PS3 like their first product basically I was I was on the Elgato train from the beginning with that first product and I loved it and ever since then I've just been like I, it's insane how versatile their shit is now so like every time they announce something new it's not all for me but every time they announce something I'm always like eyes fucking locked to whatever they're doing because they're like some of the most they make some of the most innovative like stream tech ever and I mean that I mean that so completely and a lot of that is because they they utilize their software very well their hardware is usually never something entirely special but they fucking they unlock innovation in their software that like ties into the hardware it's so cool anyway i'm gonna stop geeking out <laughs> i just i, I wanted oh, to mention it because it made me better. so excited today Thank and i realized i didn't say see? anything about it sleep tight dear I'm going to turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr, sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey, come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupting Have any goings on. I'll arrange accommodations. Oh. Time to construct so a... that's what's left of Tyr, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through. Oh, we already saw this, hmm. by the way. So have we all. Autosave kind of put us back a few minutes. Maybe a few seconds honest, more accurately. That's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hard tack. Hard tack. Any sort of humble ship's Hard tacks? Food. Aren't those sharp? Well, I'll see what I can do. <laughs> I know, I love it. This is Perhaps I'll be able to sleep tonight. Hopefully. Really sleep. The sleep of a free man without the All Father's eye on me. You lost 15 hours of progress. Shit. Oh my god. Well, you know what? we're going again. I'll just look quietly. Okay. Um. What did I come here to do? I don't know. I, I'm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if this stream. I'm just gonna say it up front. If this stream is a little rough, I apologize. I'm extremely out of focus today. I'm gonna do my best, all things considered. Um, I'll do shield guys. I feel like the Dauntless Shield. I really like the Dauntless Shield because when you can land it, oh my god, it feels so good. But it is high risk, which for me is a problem. But I honestly feel like I've been kind of... Last stream, I felt like I was really getting into the feel of it. Um, I think I am going to keep upgrading the Dauntless Shield and just keep practicing. Because it's really fun. It's an extremely fun gameplay style. And I like, I like the... I like the heightened reward compared to the, you know, the less heightened uh, stability, I guess. I don't know what that says about me personally, but, you know. High luck chance to grant a rage burst when parrying. It's just, yeah, it's just up that. Why not? Okay. That'll mess some folks up. You do anything armor-wise? Anything new? And the Barker is asking what is new. I told her I would ask. No, we're still kind of locked on this one. But man, it's going to look really cool later down the line. I'm telling you. That looks, that one looks kind of, <laughs> I don't really like that much at all. Actually, I actually really like the, the color palette that this that the pauldron of might gets in the later upgrades 
I don't like the green, you know, or like the aquamarine that it like starts with. And of course, y'all know I, I love this look. I kind like I really kind of want to go back to it. I I miss it. <laughs> I really miss it. But it's just that this one is so much better. This one is so much better, and also I just realized it gives me a health burst when I stun grab an enemy. Damn. Okay. I'm, I, I don't really... We don't have a whole lot of new stuff to play around with there. Let's just... Who am I? If you don't care about me, I'm gonna get in this pot. Cook me like beans. <laughs> what are you thinking, brother? I am thinking. I want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to climb a tree again. <laughs> Certain ships have sailed. This isn't a ship, it's a bathtub. I just wish Atreus were not so... restless. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. He's great. Don't call Tyr a mistake. You expect too much. Aye, perhaps. <laughs> he's, of course, he's fucking listening. Ugh. Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. No. I don't suppose it is. Why are you holding the mistletoe? Trouble sleeping. Ah! <laughs> Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I had to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by- Oh my god, wait. Someone murder. just pointed out. No, this is a good point. I isn't this is like the first time we've ever seen the camera move away from Kratos. Right? Oh no, the implications. Oh my god. But we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it though? No, no way. Oh my God. <laughs> How about I suggest an alternative? Something much Holy less risky, shit. but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So you know where Freya is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? Oh, that's so cool. Oh my God, we fucking just get to play like a whole section as Atreus. Oh my God, that's awesome. I, oh, I wonder what he plays like. Oh, man. Okay. I wonder how, like, I wonder how, Glad you I wonder how deep this is. Drusil. They seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. Oh, I shit. Oh, look at him go. Air. Yo, his run well, feels actually like awesome. Should we swing by oh. the cabin first? <laughs> no way! Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh, oh my god! 
Ben no, I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh. Oh. I'm very sorry to hear that. Whoa, his As oh my god, his spin dodge. Very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but why traumatize either of us further? <laughs> I can't stop. I can't stop doing this little. I'm gonna do a little dance. Spin attack. Wait. So what kind of? Whoa. And he has his. He has a whole entire menu. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh <gasps> no! Fucking way. <laughs> Oh my god, the reveal! We literally only see these up to this point, and it's like, hmm, a lot of empty space here. I can't, I can't believe this is awesome. It, and like, it makes sense too. Like, I mean, his whole thing is that his whole thing in this game is that he's like growing into his own character and like developing uh, like a much heavier sense of independence and like agency and um. Uh, I'm thinking of another word. I think it's literally in here. No, I can't. Um, but like, it, uh, but that that makes so much sense that like then you know, he'd become a separate like playable character. Okay. Uh. But <laughs> the thing hasn't hold on. Enter the Mystic Gateway. Yeah, well, we're we're here. I don't know if it's just taking a second. Oh, there it is. Whoa, it's way up there. Na, 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 na. If you don't care about me. Sorry, I can't, I can't stop. Okay. Caught a whiff of something awful near the oh. Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the oarsman. But that's what makes you think Jormungandr's nearby? I know what I smelled. Okay. Well, a lot's kind of happened, and I need answers. <sighs> and the first time we, like... The first time we go back to Midgard... Is that frozen lightning? ...is yeah. with Atreus, where we Want get, like, this kind of new perspective no. on the whole thing, not only just because of how it looks, but also <gasps> mechanically now. <gasps> This is so, this is so clever. Yeah, it looks fucking gorgeous. The chest. <laughs> Not so easy, huh? Shut up! No! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, we tried so hard. That's so fucking funny. I I'm 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 completely in love with this. This is amazing. What are you looking at me for? Oh, I gave you the fancy bowstring. We get to do these ourselves. So father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died, but I don't know what he's talking about. Accidental magic? That is disquieting. The one thing that's weird about playing as Atreus is that I feel like oh, Atreus nice should be able to jump whenever he wants. <laughs> like, it feels weird not having, like, a jump given how, like, small and spry he is. into a bear. A bear? Including the slobber. Yeah. And I lost control. Frey knows magic better than anyone. She could help me. But not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. It's venomous? Now that I think about it, maybe this is kind Shoot of the barrel. It's got soundstone on it too. Maybe this is kind of the way to emulate you know the experience of Kratos like getting a new weapon rather than actually like giving him a new like arsenal in this game. They're like, oh, you want you want to you want me on there? How about an entire new character with his own entire fucking move set? Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. How about fucking bow and arrow combat? <laughs> like that's awesome. 
How'd the Arm of Tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. Huh. Oops. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. And I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. No way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? <laughs> with some help, huh? Sting. Back on my beam. Back on my beam. Broccoli! Oh my god, what if we got to say broccoli? Well, what do we have? I don't think they would make it like XP skill. Thing. I think I just need to look around more. Oh, look here. Oh, I think this is just where we came from. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, but, but, aha! Uh -huh. So, Tyr's arm. Your father owed Thora blood payment. And, well, he got it. Wow, great story. Is this where we came from? Oh, I don't think so, actually. Wait. Oh, no, it is. Oh, it, it, oh it's just very circular. Got it. Is there anything I can do right here? Oh, we're gonna, oh, we're gonna come back here. I see. All right, never mind. I have to worry too much about it. That's like a whole fucking, that's a whole path. <laughs> Probably for, I assume, when you come back here as Kratos. Oh. Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled, bear rampage? It's me. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching- Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Oh my god, okay. wait, does Sindri get Here to join us nothing. in combat? I- Oh my god. That's quality craftsmanship! <laughs> this is so cool, okay. Stop <sighs> up! A little help would be nice. Uh, okay, right. I'll just- What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Take this, you dirty power rocks. Oh my god! <laughs> Square! Oh, Holy shit, That's no fine. way. Not sure he'll recover. Shut up. Do you want my help or not? Alright. Oh all right. my god, that's actually g awesome, dude. Yeah. Let's throw bombs at him and shit. Oh goodbye. I'm kinda melting them. So fucking Sindri is our Atreus. Oh, uh, do we have a? Oh, no way! Ah! Holy fuck! Oh my god! This is amazing. He's so cool. And he's like a character, he's like a character that he can... Oh my god, he's actually g Awesome, dude. Dude! No! He's so cool! <laughs> Sorry, I can't get it out of my head still. I've been thinking about it for like a week straight. Oh, whatever. Please stop Grinch reacting. <laughs> you do realize that the fact that you <laughs> that you're calling it Grinch reacting and Grinch posting is making me want to do it more. Okay, so it was like a a Grinch. I wonder what this is all about. Oh, okay, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll come back later. I, I I tried to press square. I don't think Sindri has anything for this. Try one more time. Yeah, nothing. Okay. 
He's so cool. <laughs> a little bit weird, but... <laughs> I think the lift switch Stop! Is now you're enabling me! Stop! Stop enabling me! You can fix it, can't you? <laughs> okay. Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? <sighs> oh no. I am not based in Grinch Pilled, okay? I'm only one of those. Guess which one. Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look. Can we, wait, can we please actually ban the word Grinch in chat so people have to use like stars when they, when they say like Grinch posting? Oh my God. That'll be the fucking funniest thing in the world. Hold on. <laughs> He's always like a, a great. Well, let me see. I don't know. I don't know how to do it. Locked. Block. Hold on. Maybe it's in the creator dashboard. Okay, so he's like a, a Grinch. Moderation. Verification chat rules. Ban chatters. Block terms and phrases. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ban the, I'm gonna ban the, oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna ban the word Grinch. You do need to add Grinch pilled? Oh yeah, good point. <laughs> okay. 1984. You now you're still allowed to say Grinch in chat. You just have to censor it, okay? That's the rules. We're not gonna personally get on to you for saying Grinch in chat. You just, <laughs> you just have to censor. It. <laughs> okay. People I care about it keeps Fuck. bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. Norman Gander's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, <laughs> we're here. Oh no, it's a straight up ban. It's, it'll be banned until I remove it manually. If and when. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you say That's not weird at all. Uh oh. Hi! Oh shit! He's here! Moo! He was just so sleepy. He was sleeping in ice because for, for a lot of people it's easier to sleep when your body is cool. Still so he's so cool. Unironically. Hi.
ironwood. What is that? Ironwood. What is that? It's ironwood. Oh. Oh. That's all you're gonna say? Well, don't let us keep you up or anything. Good talk. Ironwood. What do you think it means? It means we should have stayed home. <laughs> okay. Let's head back. Well, this wasn't super fruitful. Yet. Already? No going back that way, but I know another path. This way. What about this way? Can I... What about this? <laughs> Door's frozen. Maybe I can... <laughs> he's... He's just not strong, unfortunately. Would you, well, you know what? Really... For, for a kid his age, he's probably incredibly strong. But, you know, compared to the Kratos. So what was your plan, anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Holy ah, fuck, we're, we're just gonna, we're just gonna go? No, <laughs> we are Brian not! Post. No, He's we're not! Smug. No, we're not! Look. Baldur tried to kill her. We had no choice. Not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. We're, do we're gonna die. <laughs> we're gonna die this very moment. Oh, he <laughs> has such a hard time. We're about to fucking die. I. It's insane to me that I genuinely, like... I have no concept, clue, or or any idea as to what the hell is going to happen in the rest of this game. And we have, like, I don't know, like, 40 to 50 hours left at least. <laughs> like, this is... I'm really starting to understand how crazy of a journey this is about to be. Because I already feel like I've run five miles with this game, you know? And we, like, just started, basically. Whoa! 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 Cool! Oh my god! That's quite enough excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna do like I'm gonna do as much of the side stuff as I can stomach doing in a streamed playthrough. Obviously, you know, I'm not gonna 100 percent the game on stream. That would just that would take the rest of my life, <laughs> it feels like. Um Looks but like soundstone on the wall. I'm gonna do a lot of it. Mainly just because I've heard it's extremely good. And I don't want to see it from anyone else before I can do it myself, you know? Yep. Uh. Oh dear. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. Yeah, don't be a baby. Babies suck. I... Fine. Just step between the realms, then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet Vessel, I wish it did. <laughs> See? Was that so bad? 
I sincerely hope I never have to do it again if that's what you're asking. Dude, Atreus, if you didn't want him to be a baby, why are you holding him like one? Uh, my shop. I just, it just feels like it kind of. Well, if I can't stop you, then you're betraying this is your as far as I go. your ideals. I'm gonna stay. Fix this. Oh, this is a workshop. Shoot yourself. Oh yeah, <laughs> we have we have many. Um, let's just really like widen up our melee we'll set first. Evade attack, very useful. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, hold R one to trip and strike. It. Jesus. He'll, he'll fucking go crazy with this one. Okay. And that's all I can get. That move is called beat their ass. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, you're not wrong. That move is called die now. <laughs> need to find another way around. You Perish sure you today. Wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. Why not just leave it with Sindri? To be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? I'll hide it under my shirt. Like, she doesn't have fucking, like, witch x-ray vision magic. I have to try. Won't be able to sense it immediately. L leave it with Sindri. If it's gonna be a problem, you don't, like, this kid is not smart. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> just keep going. No, you know what? I'm not gonna- he's not being smart. I'll put it that way. Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan! Yeah, no Rob kidding. Says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think- Yeah, Shadow in particular. This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living! Living is an option! Okay, which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Did anyone else see the chat yeah. flash, or was that just me? What, like, on stream? Let me see, hold on. Oh, like that, at the top? I don't know. Didn't see anything? Okay. Like, all of Chad disappear for a moment, not on stream. Oh, okay, well. Then I have nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm doing everything right, as usual. Yeah, Twitch is just broken and busted at every opportunity. It can be broken and busted. No worries. It's just like that. Beat his ass! <laughs> oh my god! Ah! Oh, that's so cool. Ouch! Ah! Holy shit. He's really, really fun to play. It doesn't have... I don't think it has quite the visceral satisfaction as Kratos' combat with the axe and the blades, but um, I assume it'll All it'll right. keep getting better the more good. we skill up. I wonder what's our what's the runic attack we have. Oh, that's stinging, stinging barrage, right? Probably.
I don't know if I should test it. It's probably that. Something's missing. It's blocked. Oh. We need to destroy the sonic piece first. What? What? What about destroying? Please don't. Right. I just need to get a different angle on the sound. Oh. Oh, you can do two different kinds of... <laughs> you can do two different kinds of arrows. You can do yellow, or you can do green. Both of them explode pots. But in different ways. Man, your father could see me now. Oh, he no, 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 it. not this way. You. I think yellow is broccoli. Um, clearly you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Green is broccoli, obviously. That's the color of broccoli. I wouldn't have to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> yeah, you don't say? I think the way I can get him to trust me is if I constantly go behind Maybe his back. If you listen to me. Could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? I learned it by watching you, Dad! <laughs> Man, dude, Atreus? Atreus just can't... Just can't receive a W. Even in his head arguments, he's not the one winning. <laughs> what was that? Oh, that was the, uh... Forward evade attack. Stop. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? How to keep going up? Wonder what mom would do. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? Cause I am big and smelly. Yeah, I'll say. Or one for Atreus, oh hell yeah. <laughs> Atreus has a five foot vertical leap. Well, yeah, I mean, we kind of knew that. He's had a five foot vertical leap since game one. Did 
Never been so happy. Oh, no! Atreus, no! He was just a man! Control your impulses, boy. It may be sick, but it is sick in two I'm ways. Going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. Ow! Ow! Jump up! Oh, I see. Watch this. Ow! Ow! No! Get off of there. This is my bridge. No! Oh my god! <laughs> Fucking ruthless. Hey, no, that doesn't entirely work out for me in the long run. Oh, you're still here. Wait a minute. I'm still here. Good old Nigel. I love that he just whacks him a bunch on the ground. Yeah, I like how Atreus' combat style... It's obviously, it's like skilled, but it's also... very, like, energetic and like... mobile and also like, you know, when he gets into it, he's very like... Rah, 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 rah. You know? Oh, which I guess, you know, with, with a... With a description that specific, you could say the same about Kratos, but... Oh, look at that! Right? Yeah, I got this. Oh, we got this. Hey, shout out to all the slag heads in there <laughs> in jet today. I may not know you, but I see you. Freya shouldn't be much farther now. Just need to look out for that big door. Are those here something fishy's gone oh this would help me if i was back on that bridge getting shot at by the guys that were up here alas i did not see it i didn't see it
Hi. Hello down there. Hey. <laughs> Come to your senses yet? Yes. I mean, uh, I'm not changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts. No, we're not gonna be mean. Okay, we'll be a little mean. Never no, do. come on! Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that, but by all means. I didn't know we going. were gonna hit him point blank. <laughs> Low key posting. Oh, look at me go! That's the door. Just be sure to scream if she starts killing you. <laughs> Thanks. I feel so much better now. <laughs> Can I do it again? I kind of want to do it again. I just came from here. Yeah, no kidding. Wow. <laughs> we discover something new every day. Oh my god, this game is immensely gorgeous. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. She probably avoid mentioning that. Yeah, hey kid, what are you thinking? Hey, Freya, why am I wearing this around my neck? I can't, I can't move. The arrow I... tip that killed your son? Really weird. That's a great question. Uh... <laughs> I'm so dead. Leave it with Sindri! You can go back and, hey! You have the arm to fucking throw that snowball point blank at his face. Why not just, like, toss it down there? You you can still it it would take two seconds. Oh my god. You are not making wise decisions. And again, you know that is that is Loki posting in a way. It's in character. But like shit. All, all of his decisions, fittingly, I feel like they're here to just create maximum chaos. <laughs> Goes nothing. I know, yeah, I'm, I'm really into the the such and such posting uh, motif we have on this stream. But it, you can leave it behind this rock. You can leave it anywhere you want. Freya! You should have stayed with Sindri. Yeah, you think so? Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this! Yeah, you're too girl boss. What did I fucking tell you? You would stake your life on it. <clears throat> oh shit. Okay. What well. do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while <laughs> you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, <clears throat> save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin, nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? Emmy, he came you. to us, offered peace if we don't move against him. Oh. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Groa's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. Her character no. model is, is incredible in this game. She looks so good. <laughs> I'm so fucking happy we're, like, getting character moments with her this early. 
Because honestly, Freya has always been like one of my favorite characters in these games. So, hell yeah. Been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. Uh oh. In Jotunheim, we learned the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And. And that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They Aren't I so cool, yes. Freya? Loki. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that's supposed to mean. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. She literally just went Since and. Dead, <laughs> you won't fight Odin. And he's already won. You're giving her everything. Stop. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again. I am far from whole. Okay. I am ball. <laughs> okay. But we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Tear is alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Swarto Farm. Uh, stop! stop! <laughs> Stop! The nine realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. Oh my god! We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together. Enough. Enough! You. Oh my god. Literally zero tact, zero strategy. Leave this place. Go you and are... do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. You just gave all of the information to the most unhinged person on the face of the planet right now. <laughs> she is right smack in the middle of a three plus year murderous rampage against you personally. <laughs> Dude, he's Loki posting so hard right now. He's also idiot posting a little bit. <laughs> teenage core, <laughs> idiot build. <laughs> he's a teenage cell. Stop! Stop it! It's not right. <laughs> it's not right to be speaking in this way. Okay, so I'm not dead. <laughs> I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time, which I will never, ever admit to Sindri. Oh my god, he's coward posting. <laughs> I'm crying. I can't. I can't. This is gonna. I cannot believe. I can tell this is about to permeate the entire rest of this stream. And I'm so sorry. I'm. I'm big apology posting right now about this. Starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's gonna help us. Yo, so funny. Thank you for the resub. Oh, I'm glad you think so. Uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh, I was thinking and I, uh, got rid of it. Oh my god. She uh, didn't she? Uh, today was your lucky day. So tell me, stop. How did it feel? Lying. Like chaos. I. Chaos, eh? Chaos? I just fixed that! Oh, shit. I've still got my bag of tricks. If you need me, I'll be standing back here. Uh. 
I would press the button, but I can't. <laughs> I physically can't. What does this do? Cool things. Awesome. Ow, ow. Ow! Bye, Atreus. See you later, alligator. Nightmare. I just fixed that! Ow. I've still got my bag of tricks. If you need me, I'll be standing back here. Oh, I just realized those arrows are infinite. Ow. Why did I use that? That's not what I meant to do. You're still alive? Oh! Get him! I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. You're not gonna. Hate to bring oh. it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Okay. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Oh, okay. Sindri, what are your oh. secrets? <sighs> Chad, I'm glad we're on the same page. <laughs> See, like... uh, uh, they ever quit? Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Fucking legs swept out from under. Uh, do they ever quit? No. Oh. What the f- You scared the shit out of me, Sindri. See, this is where I think the motion controls would actually benefit, and now I see why they added them. Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. What? I couldn't accept it. I went what? to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. What? Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. Dude, uh, holy shit. Okay. Still can't. <gasps> Dude, he is big time backstory posting right now. I know that's fucking insane. Like, we're over here like, oh my god, Sindri, are you gay? And then he's just like, hey, by the way, yeah, my brother is a fucking zombie. <laughs> Ow, bye, see ya. My brother isn't really what one would call alive, yeah. That that combo is destructive. Fucking uh 
Heavy attack, light attack, then just hold it down. <laughs> and then uh, you're good. Anyway, you're good to go. You did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. You can't fuck. Yeah, you can't fucking mess with the natural order of the universe like that, man. What do That's you mean? Just, you choice. can't play around with that shit. I, I couldn't be alone. Aw. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. You just put my camera over there. Let's go Why? Before Stop. Father wakes up. That Stop. might be the best idea you've had all night. Stop. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. What? <laughs> don't, don't, don't be mean. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, idiot. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? Oh, whatever, Loke. <laughs> Stop! No, that was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. I hate it. How about, how about us? All right. <laughs> Shall we? I think it's really symbolic. Coming home empty handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to. Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything. Lil Jotun? Failure. Oh my god. You saved That's his him fucking from a hip hop name. Fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. It's a fucking cartoon run sound effect. Go, go, go. You just said we went for a walk. Not the list that concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? I trust their wisdom, and this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother! Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Oh no! Oh my God! Is this sausage? That is the the fucking comedic sure. timing on that. I remember food tasting better. <laughs> I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? To your cooking arc. Trace, where are planning our next move? Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim. Home of the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are. Thanks, <laughs> Muha. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? I wasn't sure you, um. Never mind. That's great. I'll find. <laughs> hey, don't go forgetting this, what'll get you there. This is a great scene. You know what? Uh oh. I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, have fun. More for me. 
they're they're acting the least natural that anyone has ever acted. This game is like this game is like really funny. Like the first game was funny a lot of the time. This one's like actually fucking hilarious. Like but it's never like Here. Well, that really just happened. Like it's all very natural. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. camera around so where'd this plan come from oh from Mimir, of course i was merely asking how you found me and he explained the secret prophecies inside the yodnar shrines fascinating from there we sent to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the temple of light and now that we can actually go to alfheim the prudent course of action became self-evident Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of her talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. This, is this option? Am I just, like, sitting in optional content well, now? Rock. Or... These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight! And never mind what Brock had to trade the landlord to get that Intrasil seed for you. The landlord? Oh, I can move it any time. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, okay. I like, I want to just, like, hang out. Oh, there we go. They're <laughs> like, go. And now we are Kratos again. This is so good. How's the table coming along, Sindri? Thank you. He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. <laughs> is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? He just doesn't find he just not he's just not used to sleeping in a bed. Like you ever seen, uh, you ever seen Castaway? That's like a whole thing. At the end of the movie, Tom Hanks has been sleeping on a cave floor for like years upon years upon years. So when he get when he like, this is spoilers for Castaway, by the way. <laughs> right behind you. I'll you haven't you seen Castaway. Uh, then when he, when he tries to sleep in a bed at the end of the movie, he's like, he just can't do it. That's a good fucking movie, but it's like, it, it like... <gasps> my heart ached watching that movie. So, in so many ways. Excuse me, sir? Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. The squirrel?! <laughs> <laughs> my goodness, what a strapping physique. Oh, hey, that's someone! Of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Uh, Holy shit, his animation is so good. Tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Th this is incredible. Oh my god, this is amazing. What? I fucking love this. Mm. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squid ink. No. Not one for gastronomic exploration, I see. Wait, if you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> Ain't that the fucking Pixar movie? You with me? That one? Cool. But you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. 
I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Park off! I'm busy! <laughs> Bitter I squirrel! I suppose that was to be expected. What? Anyway... <clears throat> now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. This just became a fucking Indeed. cartoon! A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. He's so cool. And he's like a char he's like a character that you can Oh my god. Ah, so that's why good Master Brock needed an alpine seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. Paths split like branches of the Yggdrasil. Alfheim awaits with a long and difficult journey. The training grounds of Nilfheim hold secret rewards. Bartalfheim may hold unfinished business. Choose carefully. New Yggdrasil seeds for Alfheim and Nilfheim. Swartalfheim remains at your disposal. Okay, you so... Resolved business amongst the dwarves. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places. A realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. I want to do... I want to do some side stuff really quick. I feel like I would like to, uh, handle some unfinished business. I... I would love to look at... Available quest, The Crucible. What does that mean? Alfheim and... Nil oh, we gotta choose one of these. Red at Tosker's Realm Seed leads to the Nilfheim training area. Travel here for a place to practice and improve. Okay, cool. Uh. Uh, I can't. I can't go back to. Oh, the realm is currently locked. Got it. Okay. Uh, let's check out Nilfheim. Niflheim. I mean. If we're not going to Alfheim yet, it's probably best for Tyr to wait for us here. The soldiers we fought in Svartalfheim, those were Einherjar? I thought Einherjar were just spirits in Valhalla until Ragnarok comes. They were no spirits. Indeed, brother. Odin appears to have found a loophole. Activated his forces early as a standing army. Perhaps something he could only do without any honest Valkyries around to stand in his way. Okay, um... <clears throat> I saw... Wait, I saw we had a... Friends. Let's read about Ratatosker. I want to learn more about Ratatouille. <clears throat> okay. Um... A large and extremely talkative squirrel who claims to take care of the world tree. He is overly familiar, <laughs> yet seems harmless and benevolent. His spectral aspects have aided us before and may again. I don't... Was that just, like, an ability in the previous game that I didn't use? Or was Oh, was that, like, one of, one of uh, Atreus's, like, funny little special things, like broccoli? Like the wolves? Yeah, it was a summon. Okay, cool. Um, the squirrel summon for okay, awesome. He revealed that the stone given to Atreus by Dina was a seed for use in, tra in realm travel. He continues to prove useful. I may tolerate his excessive blather. I like his blather. Do we have to be here? Creeping me out, all these poor bastards with their souls cut up. Wait, are those... Oh, oh shit! The ones we've been destroying all this time? So it would seem. Sorry! Big awkward, Free sorry Free. about that. Huh? Free. Free. 
What do you think that means? I don't know. But there's definitely something more going on here. Did they unionize? That's pretty sick. Their thoughts. I, I can't read them. They seem to like us, though. One hopes. I suppose we should continue oh, so to destroy many... any of Odin's ravens when we So find many them. rewards. We, so we just got new waist armor. What does that look like? Whoa, cool. Increases the healing from health stones, rage, and gear. I like that. That's pretty cool. Okay. A little bit weird, but... These unlock the more ravens you kill? I would assume, yeah, because we, we've got a couple. Um, I wonder if that's in... Is that in goals? Labors. Wait, they're called ratatasks? Stop! That's so good! Ratatasks anxious. What, what does this mean? of life. I don't know if this is where I should be looking. Rata tasks. Oh yeah, these just get me XP. Favors. Oh, the eyes of Odin. Six of 48. Yeah. Kill Odin's ravens and open the raven's gifts. That's, that's incredibly cool. Hey, can I just kill you guys? I can't. <laughs> Damn it. They're, they're quote, friendly. Okay, so, and then I guess there's, like, a training area over here? I can board some new stuff. Seems like you might need the help. Shut up! I don't need any help. I'm not even gonna use my axe that whole, this whole there's time. Watch here. this. Ah, a memory of war. You could use this as a training arena if you like. You'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies. They won't be able to harm you. Sparring arena allows you to test and hone your skills in combat. In the arena, you have infinite health and accelerated cooldowns. There's no XP or hack silver gain in the arena. Huh. Okay, well... Um... Boring! <laughs> Let's go! No, actually, that is, like, super useful. I'm really glad that's there. Brock, what do you think about fate? I don't. Either your life's all written down somewhere, or it ain't. Still feels like you're making choices either way. Yeah. The shit smells the same regardless of how it got shat. He's so wise. I mean, like, you know, it's it's vulgar, but actually, that's like a totally, that's like a completely sick philosophy. Though. Fortified Frost Knob. Ours Lucky Knob. Even with the Lucky Knob. I mean, like, I have... Do that. This is still fine. Okay. I might also. I'm gonna you upgrade just like so that. Much as a paper cut in that. up our strength like this if we upgrade this one more time which we can totally afford to do but but like at the same time 
These just have such cool bonuses. I don't really... I mean, this is probably, like, a super well-round, like, good option, as long as we keep upgrading it, but... I don't know. I just like the, the specialized nature of it. Um, let me also spend some skill points, because I haven't done that in a little bit. Uh... Oh, nice, yeah. Very cool. We'll do that. Melee attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the Leviathan X. Okay. That's all we can do uh, axe-wise. Unless we can also... Is there any... No, only, only a couple things have like, slots like... Evade attack for the blades. Easy grab. Chaotic Rampage extension. Oh yeah, that's the hold attack. Okay. What's uh what's this? Ooh! Yeah. Nice. This is only 500, so we might as well grab that. Back. Evade attack. Ooh, very cool. And then we still have enough to get this. Nice. And Atreus has his own XP, so we can um Oh, this is Atreus. This is Atreus. This is Kratos featuring Atreus skills. But then I also assume we can... Because we upgraded these when we were playing as Atreus, so I assume it actually doubles up functionality, both when he's the player character and also when he's a companion, which I think is so cool. Yeah, because we, because this skill we got when we were playing as Atreus, and now he can just use it. Oh, that's fucking awesome! That's really good! So yeah, let's grab these. Sonic explosions caused by Atreus have an increased area of effect. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's awesome! Okay, let's go. I thought we were gonna, we, we got a little less use out of this than, I guess, I mean, obviously we can, we sh should technically probably test our combos, but like, I want to do like content. So what's next? This is still locked. Still hunt. Bridalfheim. Turn to Sindri's when ready. What's what's on our what's on our quest list right now? Hold on. I'm a little confused about. Oh, okay, so we have to right, we have to go grab Sindri before we do Alfheim, and then otherwise. In terms of favors. Find the second Muspelheim seed piece. Which we don't have. Eyes of Odin, we're tracking track that. We can't track these two. We just have to keep exploring. So yeah, okay, we literally don't have many other options than to just keep doing the main quest then. I assume it's about to open up though. Let's go. Amir, what do you think it means? Seen more raiders come back as Hellwalkers lately. I thought freeing the Valkyrie Queen was supposed to restore balance to the realms and keep that from happening. That's a good question, lad, and a troubling one. If Hell's filled up again, it suggests that something's been hindering Sigrun's efforts, or perhaps something even more urgent is keeping her distracted and unable to visit, even occasionally. Yeah, sorry, Mimir. Spawn from so far away. Yeah, they did actually. I feel like they did make it seem like we were, like they just unlocked like a lot more for us to do before doing the main story if we wanted to. Uh, there but there kind of was just. <laughs> I knew you hadn't forgotten me. Go grab that chest and then come back. Master Kratos, I would speak with you. Oh, maybe this is it. Oh man, there's a lot. There's a lot going on. 
Hello. Do you know Ratatoster? Of course. We were just catching up in your absence. Of the squirrels I've conversed with, he's easily the most dapper. He just called you a diaper. No, he didn't. Oh, uh, yeah. I heard it. Um, okay. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? <laughs> I suppose we all have our off days. Care to try again? I knew there would be dialogue for that. Wait, how much can I push it? Perhaps I should install an easier target. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Any more? Okay. It's just two. That's fine. That was that was that was that's enough. It was so funny. I liked it. A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Ah, uh, don't blow smoke well. up my ass. <laughs> We've all saw it. What else is there? I have a question. Splendid. I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons? Oh no, young Master Atreus. Those are leaned worms, the brood of Neithog. Neithog? That's the mother? Neithog. Correct. She's also a vital they gotta enemy. they gotta stand closer together or something I cannot keep moving my camera back and forth a Brazilian circle of life as it were I tend the branches up here while Neetho choose the roots from below to prevent overgrowth a delicate balance so they're friendly well they're not nearly so affable as myself but Fixed. there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace Neetho is a stern matriarch as protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds... Familiar. <laughs> well, stay safe, everyone. I am already here, Master Kratos. Talk to me more. Perhaps there was some confusion. This is for calling me out here, not for when I am... Here. <laughs> oh, I'm, they're getting so much leg work out of this. Like hearing the sound of the chimes? Yes. They do sound very pretty. We're ready to go to Alfheim when you are, Father. Hold Unless on. To finish something in Spartalfheim first. I'm doing the chimes. Master Kratos, this feels very uncharacteristic of you. But if you enjoy the pretty chimes that much, I will allow you to indulge. Yes, you've done it. Well thrown. <laughs> ah, the sound of the chimes is not unpainful at this distance, so perhaps you could not. Already here, as it were. So it just keeps going. I'm gonna go until I hear a repeat line of dialogue. I see. You're deliberately attempting to push me into some sort of emotional outburst, aren't you? I'm not so easily swayed, my good man. Never thought it would be easy. <laughs> Stop with your stupid child! <laughs> oh, shit. I'm sorry. I don't know where that came from. I am... Okay, all right. Holy shit. That's so good. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Oh my god, that was incredible. Okay. This game fucks. This game rules. Stop with the stupid chime! <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go. The Strand. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves. Sure, I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever roam traveled using your temple. 
Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, Light Elves came back. We seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Cross secret. Alfheim. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Oh yeah, so this is a. Uh... Is this where? Is this is the last game where we went to go grab like that light beam, and then Kratos entered the light beam, and it was like. You've been gone for seven years, father. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. It's uh, the place has definitely seen better days for sure. I see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. This is fucking spooky. This is like a completely different vibe. Yikes. Thimble Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. Wow. Dares up. Huh. It was once full of life, you know. And music. The song of the sands, we called it. Gone now. <laughs> Another victory. Hold on. Yeah, I think they're like. I hear something out there. Something the way big. that they're reusing it's in pain. realms from the previous game, but like entirely turning them on their heads in one way or another, or like showing us a different area of it, like to make it still feel fresh. Like, it's so cool. This is extremely well done. You would think it might feel samey, but like it, it really doesn't in the slightest. Even fucking Midgar, which you see for like 60% of the previous game, like, feels new and like novel. Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the Dark Elves get on best they can. <laughs> Where is that there? Oh, right, right here. Nice try. I mean, perhaps we can reach that brazier from above. Dude, 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 come here. Okay. Why are they doing the fucking Horizon Forbidden West thing? Why are they doing that? <laughs> Why are so many games doing that? That's so annoying. There. The Temple of Light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Good eye. Bifrost eye.
Is everything okay? I don't friend. Just looting no near chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes to leave. Ah, very well. Back seeing NPCs are awful in this game, the worst I've ever seen. That's no good. That that feels bad. Like Honestly, after Forbidden West, I, I thought that, like, that was going to be the worst I probably ever saw. <laughs> but, like, this is, they're, like, this is giving me the same exact feeling of, like, can you at least let me try for, like, to two minutes? I know. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. <laughs> No, there's there's no setting for it. Like it like it just it baffles me. Like why why you why put puzzles in your game at all if you're gonna do that? People yeah, people keep saying that there's an option for it because they I I assume they're misinterpreting the puzzle timers um option in the accessibility menu, which is like it's vaguely described but that one i the the uh hold on the impression i get kind of short it out for a second the impression i get is that that one is for um like actually like timed puzzles because there are oh shit you're right <laughs> no i totally forgot the chest i apologize <laughs> i was i was too busy complaining about the back seating that i uh totally forgot um but like it's for uh like because there are actual puzzles in the game that were also in the previous game that are like timing based you know like, like break a certain number of things in the allotted amount of time um and though that increases the timer for those but npc hints are mentioned nowhere in the options menu <laughs> One NPC hint I do like is if you discover everything in an area, a trace will say the only light looks like you found everything. No, I I love that. Like, I love that kind of stuff. I, I truly, like, I don't mind stuff like that. I It's literally the, the one thing that this is doing and that Horizon Forbidden West did that I cannot stand and that also fucking Rift Apart did that I can't stand and I don't know why they keep doing it is literally just telling you the answer to a puzzle that they gave you not even, I'm not kidding, like, not even two minutes into trying to solve it. Like, you go to a puzzle. Like, you hit, you hit a room that has a puzzle in it. You look around, and within two minutes, an NPC or the main character tells you, maybe if I do this, then it'll solve this. And it's like, wh why do that? Why is the puzzle here if you're just going to tell me what to do instantly? Like, actually, instantly. and Like, I'm not exaggerating. It's almost instant that they tell you the answer to the puzzle. And, like, I, you know, like, if they want to put that in the game, that's fine. Obviously, if people like that, that is totally their prerogative. What I don't understand is how we've gotten this far and, like, three major PlayStation games have this problem this generation and they have yet to implement an option to turn that shit off because like it it upset me in rift apart it upset me in forbidden west it was not there in god of war 2018 that game was like balanced perfectly with how much it told you and how much it hinted you and for some reason they just they put it in this one it was there a little bit, but only, you know, the expected, like, AAA game amount. But, like, the difference is, is palpable here. There's a barricade up ahead. Sorry, I didn't mean to, to completely, like, Twilight halt stuff. progress just to complain. The but, like, it's something I really care about because it genuinely, like, it, like, it affects my experience with the game. It, like, actively 
um, it actively worsens my experience with it because it just makes it just makes puzzles completely pointless. And and it's not like the puzzles are particularly hard to begin with. These are not like no, like no puzzle in God of War 2018 was like a brain melting like oh my god it took me two hours to figure it out kind of puzzle you know. And I imagine this game is going to be much the same. They're already some of the easiest puzzles you'll find in any game. Why are you just, why are you removing their whole purpose? <laughs> like, they're there to challenge you briefly. The light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like It just takes me out of the game. You know, I'm, I'm not the kind of person who's like, oh my god, immersion broken. Like, I literally make fun of that, but... That is that is the kind of thing that will genuinely like completely take me out of a game. Okay. Oh, all right. Sorry. Also, also now now I'm gonna like need help because I was talking there. over them. Yeah. Okay. It's just like a. Oh wait. No. Oh. oh, oh! I see. Like, oh, cool. All right, awesome. Oh. I didn't know it could do that. Whoa! You like see the way it bounces off? That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. Ah, oh, bats! I like that mechanic. Very fun. Whoa! Oh, Jesus Christ, Sindri! I, I just called Siri Sindri. Oh my god. My brain is a puddle today. But also, Siri, you just scared the crap out of me. I don't know if y'all heard that. D did y'all hear that? Because, like, if you didn't hear that, then I sound crazy right now. No, you didn't hear it? Okay, well, basically, uh... I like just like full volume, full blast from my desk, like to to the right of me. Uh, Siri just like said some shit. Like you have to unlock your phone to do that because I guess I accidentally like activated her, <laughs> and it 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 made me jump so bad it it scared the shit out of me. And then and then I called and then I called her Sindri <laughs> by accident. Look. Do you understand these poems? Oh, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. Thing is, Penny, that we know these devs are smart with their games, but recently they've been dumbing their games down. I just can't see it being the devs' fault, but the higher ups making them dumb their games down. Yeah, I, I never said it was the devs' fault. I'm just, I'm just, like, no matter whose fault it is, I'm gonna keep complaining about it because. I, I just don't understand it. Like, I, like, well, you know, okay. I understand why maybe someone from the top down would be like, we need these games to be, like, approachable, you know? And so they, they like, mandate this kind of hint mechanic that's, like, super generous. But what I don't understand is why you would then, with how customizable these games are recently, with how many accessibility options and not e not even just accessibility options but just customization options in general why you wouldn't make it customizable it's it's so weird to me that the like the, it seems like the one thing these games refuse to let you customize is how much they will tell you the answer to puzzles when that is out of everything that they like me personally just speaking for myself out of everything that they let me change like, that's one of the most vital things that constantly takes me out of the experience. Um, also, yeah, also, I want to go ahead. I'm going to I'm going to call this out every time this pops up in my chat. Can we not fucking do the whole like, oh, it's because of game journalists kind of thing? Like, I sincerely hate that. Like, I can't stay like it's not it's not funny to me to like <laughs> just fucking like insult the intelligence 
of an entire fucking industry just because there are a few examples of like opinions you disagree with or a skill level that you personally feel you can surpass like it's it's just not I, it, it's not constructive and and no it's absolutely not because of that like i don't think that's that's not fair at all So it's like, I don't mean to get too real right now, but like, I just, you know, I, I talk about this a lot. I truly like, I can't stand that shit. It's so frustrating to me. As someone who has been like following the gaming journalism industry for years upon years, it's just, it, it really like, it upsets me. <laughs> Cause I like, I don't know. Cause like, there are so many people in that, in the industry Greatest that brother. I like highly How respect. Long ago. And I think Fear are genuinely land, like so intelligent. Alphite, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Anyway. <laughs> Oh shit, you're, we totally forgot to, we, we forgot to read the poem, sorry. Uh, yeah, sorry, <laughs> the, the vibes have been a little, have been a little scuffed for the past few minutes. We're gonna, we're gonna settle back into it in a second. Um, actually, I actually think I'm going to uh, take a break for like a couple minutes, um, cause I, I need some more coffee and uh, some water as well. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna step away after we read this. After life abandonment. After life abandonment. If misunderstood, proves the ignorance of the reader. Stick, rope, tar, black, skin, handprint, baby crying, shower, stink, death, beach. Oh, death stranding. <laughs> Grubs, delicious, bomb, piss. <laughs> Interesting. That's death stranding. That's funny. Okay. Well, that that was easy. What do I have on the? Axe right now? Oh, new runic attack. Dragging attack. Throw. That ricochets between targets. Oh. No way. So. R1, R1, R1. Interesting. I'm gonna keep the- I'm gonna keep the spinning one. One feels the best for me right now. Um, okay. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So, I'm going to- I'm gonna briefly step away. Just for, like- Again, a couple minutes. Uh, I'm gonna prepare my. I'm gonna prepare myself a new coffee, uh, grab some water, and uh, uh, come right back shortly. BRB.
Hi, chat. You know what? Things... Things got a little heated before I left. And I just... I just want y'all to... I want to really get back into the vibes of this game with happy thoughts of love and tranquility. Um, so here, let's do a little exercise. Why don't, why don't, why don't y'all let me know how these terms make you feel. <laughs> Amicable. Bloodless. Harmonious. Peace loving. Steady. Non-belligerent. Collected. Restful. Cheerful. Blessed. <laughs> Can't complain. Convi convivial? What? What the fu- what is- Convivial. 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 Sociable. <laughs> <laughs> Feeling good? <laughs> Not gonna lie, my brain didn't register any of those words. I just dissociated. Yeah, but where did you go? Was it a was it similar to a, a peaceful beach? Because if so, then that's good enough for me. Did you just did you just get around my 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 Grinch posting ban by giving it a Nordic symbol for the for the letter I? Did you mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh no. That's enough, please. I'm no, I'm not mad. I'm delighted. This. No, what the fuck? We do not have a choice. Behind you, incoming. We're the ones who bring the light. <laughs> Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. <laughs> Atreus, I don't know. This is not going to be, this is not the most constructive environment for a conversation like that. Whoa! Oh, that was a runic attack. Most unfortunate. They attacked us. 
More will follow once we're done. They truly know our way. Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father says. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. Mmm, Atreus, don't I wish you could understand how great it is to be able to lift these rocks. But of course, there has never been an opportunity where you had the chance to even try. I've always been next to you whenever I see one of those, correct? Uh yeah. I love my son. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. But it's glowing! Uh... Oh. Made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? It's a tribute to Freyr, made by the elves. He must have left it here when <laughs> there is something trip back to El uh, El uh, uh, to back uh, back to back to Nightmare. This charm is meant to absorb Nightmare. The, the principle behind such magic is not a local one, but a theory picked up by Tyr from the Western lands. The premise is a simple one. Nightmare. Seek us out in the dark, hoping to crawl into our minds and corrupt them from within. Charms such as this are meant to distract and trap the... Nightmare. Tangling them up in the charm's thread until sunrise can incinerate the devious bastards. A charm to ward off okay, nightmares. Penny, now you're overusing it. Yeah. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Tear help. Tear help. You have eyes that glow, right? It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. Grab that wheel. I don't know why I did that. I'll go first. Just felt right. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freya was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. It looks gay. Atreus. In a good way. <laughs> Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but... The realm isn't. Not anymore. Ooh. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah. It's here. You keep pushing forward. Oh, interesting. Whoa. It has to reflect the, the state of actual balance or lack thereof in the Shall realm we? itself. Yeah, that doesn't seem very good at all. What happened to the Dark Elves? What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. The lighting in this game looks incredible. They really like, oh, oh, they really like brought together the aesthetic. Holy shit. Solid light. Guess some things don't change. Yes. Whoa, Stone that was so cool. A bit of light to your axe. That's useful. Look at that. Oh wow, it's like it's it's actually a little overblown on the on the what do you I just what do you mean? I just did it. Oh. What's 
that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. <laughs> Wow, wow. Oh, the exposed, like, way overexposed on the game capture, but it looks great on my end, I promise. It's the light. Oh, oh no, Jesus. Ah. Ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. I just realized I don't want my, I don't want my office lamp to be so bright. Hold on. I want to get into the mood. I'm going to do, like, a deep, dark, like... Ooh. Now that's appropriate. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After is it, oh, and so this is where... Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. Was that where Sindri pulled the Brock out of in that story earlier, I believe? He mentioned something about the, the souls thing? Yep, okay, cool. I want to make sure I was remembering that correctly. Just like doing that move. That's the that's the closest I can get to the to the feeling of that like hold R1 axe spin attack that we unfortunately lost in the in the transition from one to two. <laughs> I miss it so much. I miss it so much. Also, I'm now realizing we 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 still don't have um our stance attacks either. Then again, I mean not that I use those particularly well. But in theory, I really like them. Well done. Though I imagine our light elf friends will be less than pleased. They just really nerfed uh, the Leviathan Axe's spin potential in this game. Although they did add the one that that it, it like chops up an enemy over and over again, like a rotating saw blade. So. I guess it's still there, they just balanced it in a different way. Is it? It is a bomb. No, I keep missing. I want to try it again. It's been a little bit. Yay! Ow! What the fuck was that? What's that effect? You guys gotta quit. No! Oh shit, I can maybe pick that back up and throw it at them. I'm quick enough. Ow! Get her! No! Oh my god! <laughs> Ow! Ow! Behind. Me when I'm in the middle of church and I want to talk about a butt, but I don't want to use such cruel, vulgar language. came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Do you go to church nowadays? No, I don't. <laughs> no, I, uh... Lucky for us, Listen, I'm... I'm at a state... Some architecture. This way, and it's called Georgia? Uh... No, I'm at a, it. Not, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna go too deep into this because this is like not the proper medium for like an in-depth discussion about my own like religious deconstruction. Uh, I'm at a state right now where I'm like, I 
am not uh i'm not opposed to religion in general and i'm not opposed to adopting a like a a set of you know faith driven beliefs of my own in the future as long as it aligns with my values and you know what i just genuinely believe to be true and and genuine about the world um but the upbringing that i came from is definitely not that and it's it it hasn't been long enough you know just kind of being able to revel in my life outside of any sort of organized like faith system for me so to start looking for a new one if that makes sense covered in hive stuff last time we were here these elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. But that's it. That, that again, that the finer details are a topic for another day, and I'm sure it's one that I'm going to, you know discuss more because i want to you know but not during god of war ragnarok probably <laughs> to them the natural resources of alfheim are sacred none more so than the light itself aye the light elf success came at a terrible price alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple so so the weird like apocalyptic There's nature more stone up there I know. I was figuring it. Sorry. I I'm gonna I'm trying so hard to not like react in rage every time they do that. <laughs> it's very difficult sometimes though, because it just I'm like I feel like oh I'm figuring something out and then it just cuts me off. Anyway, um oh maybe if we do it up here or wait that's not up anywhere. Um. What was I saying? Oh, yeah, so the, 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 oh, up here. The weird, like, apocalyptic state of the world is in part because of Ragnarok, but also just because the elves themselves, the elves themselves, which is a funny phrase, kind of threw the whole thing out of whack just by fucking up the balance of this realm through their war. So, 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 Alfheim is fucked up twofold. Also, what do we just get? Visions after rest. Let's see if I can guess that. Visions after rest. Something about sleep, probably. Okay. Own tools for crap. Oh, it's dreams! Dreams! Oh, duh! <laughs> Literally saying own tools for crafting stories instantly. Oh my god, fucking dreams mention. Dude, that's awesome. They gotta put dreams on PC. I'm telling you. I love dreams. I need it to have a bigger audience. Visions after rest lay lay in wait for explorers crafted by the imps and filled with music, joy, or horror. Among these fanciful realms lie endless creation. And possibilities where the limit is one's own imagination. That's so sweet. That's so sweet. That's so cute. I fucking love dreams so much. Oh there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here, get back. <laughs> Dear, stop. I said no. There seem to be some deep cuts they're referencing. Yeah, I'm glad they're not, like, immediately going for all of the obvious ones. I mean, they did a little with, uh, you know, Last of Us Part Two and Horizon, but like, like they they fucking threw in Death Stranding, Dreams, fucking MLB The Show, like that's that's really cool. I like that a lot. Oh, 
Oh, also, oh my God, I don't know. Oh, uh, I don't know if I should say this actually. I had a brief bit of like optional like world dialogue spoiled to me. And, I, and I'm not mad about it because I think it's just so delightful in and of itself, knowing that it exists. Um, I won't, I guess I won't, I won't say what's said exactly, but essentially this game at a certain point implies that fucking PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale is canon. <sighs> At least I tried. I get it now. Why they keep fighting? The Dark Elves want the souls and the light left alone. The Light Elves want to keep using them. Yeah, I don't know where the dialogue is and I don't know how to activate it, nor do I want anyone to tell me. But it exists. It exists. And I'm so happy about it. Um, also, I just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna up the rotation speed. Or just like general. I'm not our place to say. Whoa, that's too much. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm interrupting dialogue more than I mean to. I, I apologize. I just. An elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alpha. Right. Another chest over there. How do we reach it? We cannot. Let us continue. Oh, okay. <clears throat> they sure made a lot of these light doors. Fortifications. Aye, none too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Oh, I can literally just... Oh, no, I can't. Uh... See, see, now... Now I'm, I'm inherently encouraged to just start speedrunning every puzzle just to see if I can beat it before they tell me the answer. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, there we go. Oh, and then put it back up here. Oh. Excellent. Let's continue our ascent, yes. Left side, brother. Nightmare. Nightmares are so much more fun to fight as Kratos than Atreus. I will say. I don't know why. You you'd think it wouldn't be. You think it actually would maybe be the other way around because Atreus has like the bow and arrow, so you can get like, oh, like a bullseye shot in the eye, but not quite. Oh, you know what? Now I also need to up the uh, aim sensitivity a little bit. Just a little bit. Just by one. Yeah, that's good. That's fine. Oh my god, they're, they're so fucking... Rolling these poems at me. Poems, brother. Why Tell would me. I choose a favorite? Please, please pick a favorite. I want to know what Kratos' favorite PlayStation game is. Please. This is um. This is contributing to my theory that they're throwing a bunch of these at us at the beginning because at a certain point the tone of the game is going to change entirely, and these are not gonna be like <laughs> like fitting at all. Spirits within walls. The power of visual art. Oh, this is a concrete genie. I can already tell you. A gentle boy in his brush found kinship along the walls. His creation's playful sprites brought joy to one and all. The town, once empty, now flushed with color and laughter. A boy hailed, or the boy hailed a hero. Through, though merely a talented drafter, his mission save his home, threatened by seas and disuse. His weapon imagination, blues, reds, purple, and chartreuse. I I really want to play Concrete Genie. Um, 
I definitely I've I've been meaning to for a while. <laughs> I cannot figure this one out. You are so fast out. I I just I I know about Concrete Genie. It's like you know it just depends on like. Do you know about such and such video game? I just I just follow video games very closely. I like I truly like like games are such a major important part of my life that I am like constantly thinking about and obsessing about and looking into. <laughs> Obviously there are there are plenty of gaps in my knowledge, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying like, oh my god, I know so much. But like, you know, I have like a I have a reasonable grasp on the industry as a whole, I, I would say. I'll leave you to it then. Another light out to the left. Confirm Benny has played every game ever made. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Ow, I feel like I should. Hold on. What does that want? What does that symbol mean? I'm so curious. Ow, 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 ow. No, I don't want to use a resurrection stone for that. That was embarrassing. I'll just, I'll just restart. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> don't tell me what to do. Yeah, Concrete Genie looks so cool. I wanna, I wanna play. I don't think it. It's not very long, is it? How long is it? Hey, look. I could maybe throw that in some point soon, if it's not too long. Concrete Genie. It's a. Oh my God! Yeah, it's only like eight hours max. That's yeah. That's not. That could be that. That's a one streamer. Maybe we'll maybe we'll take a little detour sometime soon. Check it out. To Just to get it out of the way, cause like I, I, you know, I've been like I said, I've been meaning to for a while. Ow! I have no clue what that one means. I, it seems like it's like a timing thing. I'm so curious. Oh. Not what I wanted to do, but. Kill me up for a second, at the very least. Oh. Oh, I gotta... I wanna wait until they do another one of those and experiment and see if... So I think maybe, maybe it's like a... Like if you hit them... Atreus, can you get off of him and let him do his thing? Maybe if you like hit him while he's doing that. I just wanted to <laughs> get some of that energy in there. Atreus, stop! Get off of him! Get off! Leave him alone. Leave the man alone. Come on. Come on. Oh! Sword guy, sword guy. Cold blue sword guy. Here we go, sword guy. Come on. Oh! <laughs> okay, fine. I'll beat the shit out of them. They're not doing it. Oh! Oh, damn it! The, the one time! Come on. Try it. Do it. Do the thing. Do the thing, I beg you, please. I just want... I just want you to try it one time. Just one time when I'm not attacking you. No! Oh, that was my bad. Not as violent. I, I literally was just. On the other side. It wasn't violent. That was Whoa, slow. Tyr can really jump. Oh, Tyr can really jump. Did you say jump? Bungie, 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 bungie. Here we go, bungie. Come on. Ah! Those freaks were untrustworthy from the get go. That's the Holy wrong. shit. Oh, I see. Another chest. Yeah, idiot. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. Guess that's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. This battle he offers counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Guess he's in the light now too. Oh, this is fun. This is a fun one. Nice. 
timing must be precise. I like that. Simple trinket signifying rebirth. <laughs> and if you need a window scraper or a course of toilet paper and a fracture that applies surrounds the amplifiers. And if you need refrigerators or something something a bowl of mashed potatoes. Uh the first runic arrow from a full quiver. Damn it. I don't know what that means. Wait, no I, yeah, I do, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if we can it just took a second. Them. I feel like there was more. I feel like I saw more. <laughs> Something is up. They're in stock. Okay, wait, hold on. So it's... I have to... I have to... I have to get this out of my head. So it's... There's this stuff, Mark. If you need a rubber hose, we got those. A rhododendron tree, we got three. A wraparound deck, gotta check. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, no, wait, that's the second one. Okay, the first one is, check it out, check it out! If you want a big hat, we got that. If you need a tube of glue, we got that too. A 20 gallon wok, they're in stock. And if you need refrigerators to keep after mashed potatoes or a giant air compressor to blow food fruits off your dresser or a dehydrated strudel or a nose ring for your poodle or a fountain can into a five pack can of tuna and some flippers to go scuba. And they go scuba, scuba, stu, scooby dooby dooba. Here we go, scuba. Come on. And then they go, if you need a rubber hose, we got those. A rhododendron tree, we got three. A wraparound deck, gotta check. But if you need a window scraper and a grocery toilet paper or a ratchet set and pliers and surround and infant virus and a total solar turkey chopper and a padded gopher bopper, <laughs> flannel shirts for looking grungy and some rope for going bungee. And they go, bungee, 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 bungee. Here we go, bungee. Come on. And that's it. That's the whole thing. I thought there was more. But it's just that the rest of the song is... They go, we represent the stuff, Mart. The rest of the song is like... Like, chill. Is it, The rest of the song is like an opera. And that... they, they But then briefly, they like, break it the fuck down. <gasps> we represent the stuff, Mart. I haven't seen that shit in like, years. Years upon years. <laughs> okay, can I be honest? For some reason, I thought that was Atreus for a second, and I was like, "Why? Why?" We can continue. Video essay on Veggie Tales. No, listen. The first, the first religion-related video essay I'm going to make is about Midnight Mass. I've, I have been like, I have been two emotionally resonant moments of thematic clarity away with that show from writing a whole fucking video essay about it. I'm like so close. I'm this fucking close Here they to come. forcing everyone to listen to me talk about Midnight Mass. Nicely done. That's so cool. That's so cool that you can also use that as like a a combat mechanic. Oh yeah, no, expect expect plenty more uh midnight mass posting because uh I've been I've been basically watching it on repeat lately. I just did a full rewatch and right after the rewatch I, I started it again last night. <laughs> Shit. I'm surprised you didn't do that for Better Call Saul. Well, I feel like everything that's been said about Better Call Saul, or everything that can be said on YouTube about Better Call Saul has already been said. Like, I don't, I don't feel like I have anything to add to the conversation about Better Call Saul, like, formally. Whereas, 
Look at this statue. These crystals. Midnight Mass, I feel like, else. is grossly underrepresented when it comes to like YouTube video essay content. And I, I, I can't, I can't come at it from a very. All over the chasm. Oh yeah, interesting idea. I, you know what else gave me that idea? The fucking circle button. Um, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I, I couldn't come, like, at Midnight Mass from the angle of, yeah, like... Look, the foundation's weak. I... To push this over, give no me problem. two seconds to talk about something, please. You're... Like, they're making it so hard. They're making it so hard to talk about anything. Um... I couldn't, co I couldn't come at a Midnight Mass video essay from, like, a... Like, a... An academic perspective or, like, an informed, like, theological perspective. It would... It would be... And it will be if and when i i get it done it will be like highly personal highly personal all like all about just like the feeling that the show gives me and like what it represents to me but still i don't even think there's enough of that when it comes to oh, midnight mass youtube crystal stone content. Make light bridges now the light helps wear them smart almost there allow me I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Dude, shall we continue? That's actually so based. Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? It feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here. This is so cool. This is so cool. <laughs> also, um, Art by Black, thank you for the sub. By the way. Okay, let me figure out where these are first, just generally. This one's right here. Oh, they got one kind of right here. Thanks for thanks for that. <laughs> and then one, maybe down here. Yeah, shot it through the wall from the other room. Just a, a complete blind shot. Atreus is actually Look, so skilled. I can't look over there. I'm I'm in I'm in the ground essentially. The third one. That is the one over there. Oh, and then right there. Okay. Go, go, go. Why must they insist on these what? frustrating trials? What? You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I was in this world. Why did you try? Well done. Yeah, so the 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 timed puzzles option affects the the length you have to do those essentially those those like bell puzzles i was so scared for a second i was like bye kratos have a nice trip see you next fall And here we go again. What does that symbol mean? What is that melody? Behind you, brother. It's so nice how they fly for me. Wait, was Tyr fighting? I don't think so. I feel like that would be like a cutscene moment the first time we see him fight again. Yeah, he's just standing around. Oh. Ow! Don't do that! No! Oh. 
Oh, we cleaved them in midair. That was great. Oh, shit. I wonder if that's something to do with Atreus, maybe? Oh. Looked at the blue rings, and I'm not going to say what it is, but it does make some sense. They probably should have picked a different color, though. Yeah, I, I feel like it's, like, if you time an Atreya shot while they're doing that. I, I feel like that's what I'm supposed to do. Because it, cause it, it looks like it, it looks like a target, basically. I don't know. I'll, I'll keep trying to land it. Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield, but that angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? If that prayer not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now, can we really place all the blame on Freya? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. For Alpine, perhaps. But not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own paths, regardless of where they end. <laughs> Don't roll like that when I'm trying to do the just a quick step back and a woo, which is like one of my favorite moves in both of these games. It just feels incredible. Yeah. Nice. Oh. Aha! The shield moves. Oh, that's fun. That looks right. Hell yeah, it does. But to be fair. Uh, or not to be fair, but also to just continue actually hammering home how Last funny the backseating from the, the game is. Game. That's Hold on. Unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartli Offer. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. Right at all. Uh, I was gonna say the the funny thing is that a lot of these puzzles are like. Do such and such in exact specific sequence. Is that is that right? They said it looks right. Oh yeah, I mean I can't, I can't change it. Oh, like from here maybe. Oh yeah, from this angle. Oh, not from that angle, but I have the right idea. Probably from some other angle, I think. If I had to guess. 
from this one, maybe. Yeah. Fine job, brother. Wow. This they let way. me do that one. We're almost there. They really, really listened. <gasps> oh. Stars. Stars. Do you still hear something wounded out there, Atreus? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. Oh god, hold on. I like... My neck is stiff. Is that a stretch early? Is this bonus? Limitless. 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 What? Power? Growth? Ambition? A bit vague, innit? Limitless freight, Twinkie. Innit? <laughs> 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 yeah, for the... So for those watching the VOD later, uh, chat just exploded with people simultaneously saying, IN IT! exploration to do. Oh, wait. Oh! Uh, it's facing the wrong way. Not for long. Hmm. Maybe if we... Allow me to speed this up. Oh! Oh, shit! The angle should work, Kratos. <gasps> Thanks, bud. Well done. At your service. I will catch you. Oh. <laughs> ah, uh, the light of Alfheim. How stunning. Nothing. What's wrong? I could hear Mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now. United by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When father went inside the light, he you said he... You went inside the light of Alfheim? <laughs> yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. Oh shit! Oh so, yeah, this is the- Oh, Groa? this is where it happened! Many times. Oh, that's awesome. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... difficult. 
to say the least. <gasps> Something calling him back in? No way. Yo! Dude! No! Kratos, no! Kratos, wait! God. Oh my god. He's Fey posting hard right now. Oh my god. Oh, it's beautiful. Don't do it. What are you doing? I heard something. Father, she's... She's gone. Dude, coming back here three years later, only to like Keep moving. recontact. Oh my god, that's so cool. This is fucking awesome. Also, you know what? This is the first time I've kind of realized... This is the first time I've kind of realized that, um... This game was supposed to come out when three years had actually passed in the real world. Like, I think the reason they were probably pushing for a 2021 release specifically before it got delayed is that... You were supposed to kind of, like, feel the three years exactly... in real time. Um... May I could be wrong, maybe it just lined up that way, but it is funny that, like, you know, first one came out in 2018, and then uh, the original release goal was, was 2021, which is three years. Uh, but I, I'm, I'm glad they, you know, delayed it just to, you know, better assist work-life balance and there. just make sure it's ready. Huh. They've but changed some stuff. Last time. That would have been cool. That would have been cool. I mean, it's still only four years. Like, so many dark elves. didn't even I... not do that. All this time, I thought the Dark Elf King... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. Ooh, goddamn! <laughs> Yo, I'm actually remembering now when you beat the Dark Elf boss in the first game, like, he says something along the lines of, like, hey, like, you don't know what you're doing, like, you're gonna fucking regret this. Oh, shit. I totally didn't even realize that it, it, like... I don't know if there's, like, side content that expands on that. If not, the fact that they literally, they wait until the next game to actually, like, show you the consequences is so cool. Okay, just making sure... That's normal villain line, so you don't even really think about it. Yeah, well, I mean, like, I mean, like, I, I thought about it when it happens, but, you know, it's so early in the game, and so much happens after the fact that I, you know, it was kind of easy to forget. And then, you know, you come back here in the next game, three years later, and it's like, oh, shit. Uh, yeah, we kind of, we may be fucked up a little bit. What the fuck? Stop! 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 No. I said no. I kind of want to do it again, though. I want to do it again. Wait. Oh. Oh. 
I said no. Oh! Are these here literally just so you can do that? I, like, don't want it to stop. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave that for a second. There's so many around here still. Who do these lead to? These don't really do anything. That's fine. Well, that was awesome. Tear, where did you come from? <laughs> and where did you go? Tear! Tear! Where is he? Tear! 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 Stop! What? He's a he's a ghost. He's a ghost trapped in the door. He can only be briefly set free while the door remains open. Stop! Stop! <laughs> ah, oh, he's gonna come back. Wait! 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 And then he goes. Well, I'm still here. What the fuck? Here? Where are you? Where actually is he? He's like gone. Here. Tear boy. Tear boy. Oh, but you better not forget about me. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, we'll just keep going. Uh, that's possibly the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. The shrine is right there. Yeah, but there was a Nornier chest down here last time. Oh. Where are you? God of door. <laughs> that Brock? There it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. No, I don't think I don't think we did all make it. Dear <laughs> He's still in the door. He's still in the door. Watch this. <laughs> Dude, the fact that it, the fact that it is the same exact animation. He's fucking door posting so hard right now. He's got he's got to he's got to be He's got to get floor pilled. He needs to stop door posting and get floor pilled. Oh my god. I'm that is so funny. That is so funny. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Sindri, tears stuck in the door. Oh my god. <laughs> Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? Boy, that's nice. not Sindri. Someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the light elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two year. Very messy. Anyway, good luck.
A. Oh. This one actually looks cool. Oh, fuck. I want. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? Yeah, it is kind of orple. And it gets a little more orple the more you go. I love the color palette of that. What does the waist armor look like? Though? Whoa! Whoa! I really like that! I really like that. I really like that. I like that quite a bit. Did you say tits? Oh, damn it. I talked over it in such a way that it sounded to me like he said tits. Like, exactly. I just heard tits. I knew he didn't actually say tits, but I thought it would sound like that still. But no, it was literally just because I, I didn't hear the first part. I thought he maybe just said fits, but no, he said it fits. spend much more right now that's gonna look so cool when it's fully upgraded i i much prefer the i'll take him the armor system in this game this is really good this is exactly what i wanted it's like it's not depthless you know they didn't take away all of the customizability and you know like kind of stat nature but they like really streamlined it I'm I'm extremely thankful for that. Still no more shields. I wonder if we're gonna get more shields. I hope so. We can upgrade this one though. May it strike true. You aren't doing four menus for plus two and runic. Yeah, exactly, exactly. I, I think it's it's like the perfect balance. All right, let's see, uh, let's see, <laughs> let's see if Tyr decides to tag along and stop door Giants posting. Did enjoy <laughs> wait, was he, oh, I thought, wait. wait until you see this. Is he still stuck? His voice is really muffled. I could have sworn for, I don't know if I'm just going crazy. I could have sworn I saw his face behind that door. Hold on. I could have sworn it. I might just be... Okay, I think I'm just seeing something. The giants always did enjoy okay, I'm just seeing things. For some reason... I just... I, I... He's still so muffled. Ooh! Oh, God! So bright. Still love how these rooms look. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find here? him. He's still not here. On end. Unfortunately, she found something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. Where is he? he sought her out, demanded a private retelling. Didn't he? like what he had, apparently. He's a ghost. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. <laughs> he's what? <laughs> he's fucking. He's melded with the door realm, 
And now we stand in the middle of his domain. Exactly. We are in the door with him. We hear him clearly because we are where he stands. The floor is his legs. The sky is his eyes. And through the clouds, the windows to his soul remain. He is here. He is here. He is here. We will see him. We will know him. We will feel him. A tear is in the realm of doors. And there he will stay forever. And he, uh, he is the door to the future. He is the door to, the, to safety and love and peace. God of War Ragnarok 202211600 ellipses can't upload. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be He is actually the god of door now! Soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look, here. This is what we saw. It's you, fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't... I can't. What's this then? <laughs> That's new. What the fuck? What the hell? Asgard is destroyed? Uh oh. But the other realms thrive? And Odin dies. There he is! Oh my god! Oh, thank god. She lied. Roa lied. Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> oh my god. So then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. He's gone. And the elves. Champion. Literally, okay. every time I can't see Whether him now, is, it's like... Doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. Oh? But, but we just saw No, him. Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. I am so, I'm so curious about what's gonna happen. It is time. Time for what? We can't stop Ragnarok. But we can win it. Oh, thank God he's Asgard back. Asgard is destroyed. Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. Oh, please don't make me go back there. <laughs> please don't make me go back. He's gonna get stuck again. Perhaps we should focus on our <laughs> first. Okay. Stop! I just, I just, I'm, 
I just lost it. I don't understand why this is happening. It's so fucking funny. That's the funniest thing I've ever seen. Stop. Oh, my God. oh that's why these are here. That's why these are here, because we gotta go back and... They're here for combat. Oh, my God. Fuck. Behind you. Is it gonna keep doing it? It's gonna keep doing it. I mean, we already know it is, because look. Here he goes. Shit, I keep missing it. <clears throat> Every 90 seconds a tear gets stuck inside a door. Your donations are crucial to helping end this. Just provide me with your parents' credit card and the three digits on the back. Oh my god, no, he's back! Oh shit! I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Well, Atreus, what should we do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Uh. This way. How'd you get down there? Oh, right, he has jumps. Thing still here. Oh, Atreus, you good? Okay. Focus, this way. <laughs> 
Are we gonna have like one of those moments where it's like, like now that I know what's going on, I I can't be on your journey with you. I'm sorry, boys. And then he has to leave us for a while. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alva. That's what you have to do? You tell me now? <laughs> That's funny. I don't know why they wait so long to tell you. I guess just in case you can figure it out yourself, but like... Damn. Oh! Damn it. So they're basically attacks that can't be blocked, but can be interrupted. Oh, yeah. You know what? That makes sense. All of the ring notifications are like lock related that makes sense okay cool i like that Ow. No! <laughs> Shit. Yeah, give me up. Oh my god, okay. Tear? Are you okay? Go. Oh shit. Uh oh, what's going on? One sec. Oh, we got a new rond. Grants a blessing of cooldown when interrupting double blue ring attacks. Um. What's going on here? Ah! It is over. It is far stop. from over. <laughs> no, stop, no. I it's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what Can't is to move. Come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. Are you? What choice do we have? There <laughs> is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm... I'm not that Okay, guy. I can turn him. I can turn him around. I, don't I can turn him around. Fight. But with you three, there come is on no here. avoiding it. Come on, Tyr. Your path leads to countless deaths. Come this way. There we unimaginable go. Unimaginable pain and suffering. We did it. No, no, Tyr. No, the other way. Other way, Tyr. Other way. You got this. Yeah, come on. There you go. We're making it work. <laughs> yeah, wow. <well, laughs> this area is, like, bugged for me. Like... 
bugged out of its mind for me right now. I don't know why. That's crazy. This is like I'm not seeing anything like this up to up to this area. We're kind of um, kind of just uh maybe maybe we can restart the checkpoint. Maybe it's fine. Tear, are you okay? No. There we go. It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, Tear. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight. But with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. It's like, so now we're gonna go our separate ways. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, but why are you dragging this? Oh no! Uh oh! No! You cut oh, off your Atreus. own leg? Ah. We're following Atreus again. Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, and here comes. Oh. Hold on. Over here. Your chase. Well, this is not at all. What I thought was gonna happen. Hey, Tyr? Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I... No. I am sorry. I should never have come. Yeah, that's what I thought. We shouldn't linger. Let's not linger, <laughs> like he said. Look, I just want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Only slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough. We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. <laughs> Oh, finally, he's behaving normal with doors again. He's free of the curse of door. Yeah, I think he got it out of his system. I think we're good. Oh, 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 Jesus Christ! A dark elf assault. How fortuitous. Oh, shit. They're coming back. Oh, it's these guys! Oh, my God. Nostalgic about the enemy type. I do wish there were more finishers. 
Yeah, we've only seen like like yeah, like two or three axe finishers. I could have sworn I thought I saw something in like pre-release footage about there being more finishers. I don't know if I maybe just misunderstood something that I saw or if we just haven't unlocked it yet. Probably by more finishers, they meant more types of enemies with their own special finishers. Oh, yeah, that makes sense, I guess. Let's go, let's go. That's unfortunate. Like, I feel like it kind of... I mean, I get, obviously, functionally, finishers are, are great to have because they, like... They basically guarantee, uh, like, a death hit on on weaker enemy types, but like, yeah, I, th I think at least humanoid specifically, I agree, could have used more, because like, there are a lot of humanoid enemy types we've seen, and not a lot of finishers as a result. Ow. Holy fuck! Oh my god. Let's go, let's go. I just want to see Kratos kill creatures, living creatures and beings, with as many brutal variations of death as possible. anywhere <laughs> here are you like good dude Oh! 
I'll meet you on the other side. What's up with the with the bridge structures in these games? They they, they keep they keep exploding bridges in this area. They just don't like bridges here. I lost the flow. The elves used all their infrastructure budget on the best doors in the Nine Realms and forgot about their bridges. Yeah, but how how good can the doors be if you're getting stuck in them all the time? I guess that's just here. We were fine. Can we leave now, please? Almost there. This way. It's to prevent intruders by trapping them in a door realm. Here. I guess. We... Open the gateway, please. Hey. Oh no. Uh oh. <laughs> you want war, Atreus. See for yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. Oh? What do you mean by that? We do oh, well, I mean, I know what he means by that, but it's just... We should see this desert for ourselves. But I'm curious what the... Look, I know we can't trust prophecy. But I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now, I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Okay, so this Good. is side content. <laughs> yeah. We... That's pretty cool. Uh, let's let's do that then. Um. Vulture's gold treasure map. Search of peace, the beast finds only war. Its last breath of life atop the sands, its last meal of gold beneath the bones. Oh. Which way do you come from? <gasps> Shit. I see, I see. Oh. I gotta remember to ask Tyr about his travels to the lands beyond the seas. You wish to travel the world? I don't know. Maybe. Shit. See new places. Find out more about myself. Hmm. What is wrong with your shelf? No, I said my I said myself. <laughs> Damn it. get the exact same way. Uh... Please. <laughs> Please. Go. What is up with this fucking bird? It's like I like I keep moving my I keep moving my reticle. 
but I feel like I'm missing it in the exact same way every single time. Jesus. There has to be a better way. There's, they're usually not supposed to be that hard, but, like, I don't see another way up there. Oh, my God. Okay. What if... Right as it comes around this mountain. It's not a mountain, but... Mir. Deal with Odin's ravens. Fuck you, bird. Like Fuck you, I hate. Anyway. This is why I hate Except birds. Except for the realm between realms, thankfully. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Oh, that should have landed. Lucky us. That should have landed. That totally, that totally oh. felt like it was supposed to be a hit. Oh. <laughs> No, Trace cannot shoot. We tried that last time. This is punishment for the wind chime bit, yeah. Might as well be. I've, there, there's got to be an easier angle to do this from. I know. Uh, okay, yeah. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna wait. Hold on. There's. There's usually like. Should be able to reach the barons up top. Once we find a way past this hive matter. I remember these things. Definitely Dark Elf territory. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, we just cut through. You gotta hit them all at once, remember? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. They're, the bird's going to be so much easier to hit from up here. <laughs> Literally. Oh, my God. <laughs> See? Look. Easiest thing I ever did. See? Look at how simple that is. Right? I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna scream out loud. I'm gonna scream out loud. <laughs> okay, hold on. Stop! Stop! Please! Thank you. Now, hopefully, we got like like a nice coat out of that you know what do you think atreus hey my man between me and tear who'd ever guess i was the giant huh <laughs> indeed lad <laughs> <laughs> that's so cute wait that was adorable <laughs> hey, very wonderful japes my friend Appreciate it. 29 bucks? No way. Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know Alfine pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I... Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is... stickier than I care for. Good <laughs> luck on your search, though. Stuff some cloth in your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. I don't care about things being in my ears. I'm okay with that. I can handle ear entry. But my favorite thing to go in the ears is music. I can't get enough of that sweet, sweet music. <gasps> what? A free ride? What are these animals? Go on. Native to Vanaheim. Not sure what they're doing here. They're giving us a ride. They're giving the it's it's our Uber. Hmm. What was that? 
Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated <gasps> gulag. Whoa. Whoa, cool. We can trot and run? This game's got everything. This is so cool. This is so cool. This is so cool. I love running into walls. Yes. Oh my god, this is awesome. Like fun. Any particular direction to find your wounded Whoa. animal? Or are we just enjoying the weather? Holy I can't shit. Hear anything out here. Perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings. This is side content. <laughs> this whole this map, this large open zone is the side content. What the fuck? It's over here. This is insane. Not getting up there with all this sand in your way. Sand, more like hand. Ugh, so frustrated. I can't even get my insult straight. So much sand. I don't think we're getting through that gate in this storm. I feel like Mimir is gonna like unlock a new ability at some point. Because I feel like Mimir's like kind of color palette is probably that like kind of yellowish glow. I don't know. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. There's a lot of stuff we're gonna have to come back here later to do. Whoa. You. The train Nifelheim just got a new guess. And I hope they beat the shit out of the other guy. Like a, this is a powerful. This is like a full fucking boss fight. It's not branded as such, but. The bombs. The bombs are ringing. <laughs> the bombs will be right there. This guy, this I'm realizing this guy is straight up like the Dark Elf boss from the first game. But he's just like a mini boss now. You notice that? Ow. Fuck. Ow. Shit. 
I mean, I don't, I'm really not good with the blades. I'm not good with the blades of chaos. And again, this guy's just kind of difficult anyway. Let's try then. Okay, I'm not gonna get. Yeah, there we go. Fuck. Ow. Oh, oh my god, there's too many things to keep track of. Yeah, we got pretty close. Hey, when he starts doing his, his like bomb spam, that's when it becomes a bit of an issue. Yeah, he, he like he he doesn't want us to get close to him at all for probably good reason. Oh my god, getting these guys like to stagger is so is like such a quick way to take care of them. Boom, they're gone now. They're gone. See ya. What? <laughs> Ow. Oh, ah. Ow. <laughs> Into the rocks. Is that actually the same guy? It doesn't say anything about him. That's fine. Um, uh, largest and strongest of the dark elves we face. Lords, Lords weaponize light and use it to temporarily blind their enemies before landing a devastating attack on them. Uh, terribly strong with the thickest available armor. You need to track when they finished out an attack sequence that leaves them open to countering. Yeah, okay. So like the like him spamming bombs on the ground. That's one of those sequences we actually just kind of need to wait out before going too crazy. Use magical and elemental attacks to freeze or otherwise weaken them. Uh, will prevent them from recovering in midair once launched or disrupted. Try to keep that in mind, I guess? Because that seems like that's just going to be, like, a recurring enemy. Which is insane. Look here. Look here. What's that? A diagram for a sword hilt. Bah. Bah. <laughs> we found pages torn from an ancient tome. The pages <laughs> contain diagrams. <laughs> contain diagrams of long forgotten sword hilts. If we can't find the in ingredients, I believe the dwarves can crack can craft these relics once again. Sorry, I'm like I feel like I'm we should show it to one of the relearning how to They'll talk go. tonight. <laughs> oh, 
Oh shit! You are whoa! It's ugly in color, but in shape. Yeah, it just uh, like it's not ugly, it just doesn't match at all. It's fine. We'll keep it. Kratos strikes me as somebody who really wouldn't care about style too much. <laughs> Little bit weird, but he would like I I like he would I think he would appreciate uh, fine style in like a craftsmanship kind of way, but you know he definitely reads as more function over form. A little bit, but okay. What did I... What was I looking at? I was looking for something. I think. Are there any new poems? Alright, let's go this way. Whatever this thing is, okay. I think the animal's inside. Whatever's inside is kicking up quite a bit of sand. How do we reach it? There's caves and tunnels are plenty out here. Let's find one. See what it takes us. Can't see shit, man. We found it. Really? Oh, okay. Cool. Hey, I'll take it. Ooh, what are you? Impressive. Grinch? Oh, they're called Grimms, right? Okay. How the Grimms stole Atreus. These rooms. Oh, I gotta stretch. Hold on. God, you ever, you ever, you ever do a stretch that feels like that? Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. Dude. Oh, man. <laughs> so you just refuse to pick a favorite poem? Astrobot! Characteristically indecisive of you. 
I have a favorite poem already. One from my homeland. Astrobot, Astrobot, Astrobot. Dream. Oh, wait. Oh. Celestial construct. <laughs> Stop. A mind expanding poetic experience constructed by who else but Kavasir. Look around you, oh god. Turn your head. Guide your metal friend with care, or else it be dead. Rescue its friends. Experience tension. Immerse yourself in a new dimension. Oh, so that's specifically Astrobot's rescue mission. Cool. Yeah, that's that's the first Astrobot game. I like that. I really hope that that I really hope that, that gets a port slash sequel on PSVR two. Uh, cause I oh we're getting a whole set. Nice. Uh, cause I want to play that. I, I want to play that and. I technically own a PlayStation VR 1, but uh, one, it's not with me. It's actually back at my family's place. And then two, even if it was with me, I'm I'm never going to go through the hassle of setting up for PS5 ever. <laughs> like, there are so many fucking adapters and boxes and cords and cables that you need. Like, I, I'm just going to get PSVR 2 and just let that be what it is. Which I actually... Um, they, I just uh, opened up, uh, or they just opened up reorders for that, and I, I was, I was, I got the invitation, so I'm like, you know what? I don't like, uh, it's, it's definitely, it's, you know, it's expensive, but I'm gonna make it work. I just, I just wanted to lock it in because I, you know, they're not gonna charge it until it's about to ship, and it ships in February. So I'm like, I can, I can set aside enough by that time. I'm not too worried. I just figure I might as well. Lock it in now, because I'm, I'm definitely interested in it. First thing about the PSVR 2 is that apparently the PSVR 1 games won't be compatible unless they're updated to be so. Yeah, but like... I mean, there's a reason for that. It's, it's not even... It's not even for, like... Greed purposes. It's literally, like, the technology between... The two ways that PSVR 2 and PSVR 1 handle VR is, like, I would assume incompatible without a specific, like, patch of some kind. Um, so I don't, I don't fault them for that because I kind of didn't expect it to be any different. Yeah, it's definitely expensive. I mean, like, when you look at the, when you look at the tech behind... PSVR 2. I feel like the price makes more sense when you just look at it from like a oh wow this is actually a very high-end VR headset kind of perspective and there's a lot of technology in the controllers and everything as well like I think there's a reason it costs as much as it does but also <laughs> that's funny. Uh, there's a reason it costs as much as it does but also it is a hard pill to swallow when it costs more than the console that you need to have in order to play it on <laughs> like it's it's definitely like that's that's tough that's really fucking tough i don't and i don't blame anybody for being like man that sucks but i mean i mean to an extent like pc vr can be the same way depending on which headset you get but the thing about pc vr is that there's so many options whereas if you if you want to play the PlayStation exclusive VR games, which I assume are going to be great, you know, because I'm a big PlayStation fan, like, you know, it's it's going to be a case where, like, you need to have that very specific setup. And, you know, buying into that setup is it, it's a it's a tough price. This cave extends underneath the desert. Is the creature within? Yeah, sounds like it. We'll find it if we keep going. Maybe Sony will make what PC drivers. Place? Even if Sony doesn't do it themselves, the it. I would. One of the few remaining now that the bot. The I would imagine game. someone's gonna figure out a way to make PSVR 2 work on PC. I feel like that's a good middle ground. Also, Ku, thank you so much for the raid, uh, dudes. Brock, oh man, how clever. <laughs> Hi friends, thank you, <laughs> thank you for all the, thank you for all the God of War raids recently. Uh, were y'all playing on your end? 
Dude, this game, this game is so fucking good. I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm constantly stunned to left and right. I'm having such a good time. Sure was awesome. It's so fucking long and so fucking good. I know. We just got to the, we just got to this, uh, we just got to this bit in the Barrens. And like, it was crazy to me when they were like, Oh, you can either go back to see Sindri for the main quest, or you can go do this like animal rescue side quest that Atreus wants to do. Um, and it's like, okay, I mean, I might as well do the side quest. And then you keep going, and it opens up into this entire fucking like zone. And this is just side content. Like, that's fucking crazy to me. Like, this is optional. Yeah, and the side quests have all been fantastic. <laughs> Oh, goodbye. <laughs> they had a lot to the care. Yeah, I, I'm really like the side quests in the first game were good, but like I, I can see why the side quests and like the reviews and stuff for this one were hyped up as much as they are. Like, they put a lot of love into these. Oh. <laughs> Is fucking better win Godi at the awards? I still think I would personally give it to Elden Ring, but I am still very early into this game. And this this game definitely, it's it's growing to be a stronger and stronger contender as it as it goes on. Don't get me wrong. Um, but like, Elden Ring, man, was just I. It's gonna this game is gonna have to do something incredible in order to surpass Elden Ring. Like, absolutely, fully unbelievable, because, uh... Elden Ring was that for basically its entire runtime. <laughs> and they're, they're very different kinds of games, you know, not to, not to compare them unfairly, but, you know, if we're talking, like, Game of the Year discussion... No, oh god, I wasn't paying attention. Ow, ow, ow. Stop, owie. <laughs> Sir, we've been studying this Penny Parker specimen. Yes? And we've discovered some weird things. Well, like what? Well, one thing in particular, we just can't wrap our heads around. The patterns simply don't make sense. God damn it, tell me what it is. So she's using the parry shield, yes? Yes. Well, get this, sir. In all of our studies, we've noticed one recurring thing, and it has the whole team stumped. What is it, Johnson? She never parries. No. That's right, sir. Dear God. You know, now that I know more about the Dark Elves, I wish we didn't have to fight them. They attack us. Well, this is their home. And considering what happened the last time we were in Alfheim, can you really blame them? Where did- Ah! You were not there before! <laughs> please, please, wait. He was standing in that room, right? Yeah, well, he's right there. Ah. Wait. They attack us. Yeah, he's over there. This is their home. And considering what happened the last time we were in Alphalon, can you really blame them? Boom! <laughs> it's the scariest thing in the world. <laughs> Oh, interesting. 
interesting chest location. Let me follow up on this. There it goes again. <laughs> this is what we call Loki posting. <laughs> You know what's funny is that after I pointed out how prevalent the the blank posting joke was going to be throughout the stream, it actually hasn't been as prevalent as I predicted. But it's been it's been enough that I think it's still funny. What does this say? Gay. Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader. I choose to think it's the name of their favorite pet duck. there's video footage of Tim Curry Joker that got released. When was Tim Curry going to be the Joker? I'm not familiar with this. I'm missing the something. Creature you heard. What does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just... I feel what they're feeling, you know? And whatever this thing is, it's in a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wait, it's outside. So... Maybe maybe we should just keep going that way. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting all turned around. Hold on. I'm getting nervous about reaching a point of no return. And I, I don't think I need to be as nervous as I am. What are you? A shattered rune. Stop, what are you doing? <laughs> he was gonna voice Joker in Batman, the animated series, but Hamill replaced him eventually. Oh, interesting, I didn't know that. I had no clue. After 44 hours, I've gotten the platinum for this game, really? That's crazy. I, I thought it'd be a lot longer for a platinum. Maybe it's one of those newfangled uh, PlayStation short platinums, which I I love. <laughs> I'm a big fan. I'm getting so I'm getting so like physically like compressed tonight. Oh, I don't know what it is. Ugh. Maybe it's because I've been streaming like a fucking mad woman lately. Okay, so there's one right here, one right here. And a uh huff. One right there, I assume. Maybe. I've never been this interested before. Oh, that's something else. Can I no. talk to animals or enchanted rings or whatever. Much has changed for both of us. Well, yeah. I'm just trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal. Is this not what you want? No, no, it, it is. I'm just surprised it's what you want, too. <laughs> I mean, I get that. You don't have to... I have to <laughs> drill it in. <laughs> Sign Baloo, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. 
dude, I'm going to find this last bell. And I'm going to kill it. It can't be super far away because, like, it's timed. Is it in here? Am I just missing it in here? Yeah, I am. Oh. Dude, I am simply looking for the bell. No, ha. Ah. This one made me rip my hair out. Good luck. Oh, no. Oh, boy. That's okay. Do you think Dog of War 1 needs a remake? Yeah, I just feel like they... I feel like there have been a lot more new dog types that happened. And I, and I just think, like... They need to have an opportunity to, like, add those. I feel like the dog variety was a very big part of that game. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be mean. Um, if you're genuinely asking if I think there needs to be a God of War one remake, then like, no, I don't. I don't think there needs to be. Uh, nor, nor do I. I mean, as much as I love these new games, like, I don't personally think I would be much too interested in a God of War remake, mainly just because, like, I don't know. I, like, I, I'm probably gonna go back and try to play those at some point, but I don't know if it's gonna be anytime soon. Oh, I, I'm, I'm so confused, man. I'm so confused. Hold on. Okay. Oh, wait. You just keep going up, right? Why did it stop? Oh, oh. I don't know why that didn't come up earlier. You need the hookup? Let me know. I played them all on emulator earlier this year. They they're all on. They're all I can. They're all accessible on PS5 in one way or another. But you do have to like. I think you have to stream a couple of them, which is not ideal. But I might be able to work it. Um. Let's see. I would probably just like. Actually, like get a copy though. I don't know. I appreciate it, though. Let me lift this up. I, I have figured it out. I've connected the dots. No! Get, get down! Stop! Yay! What else is in here? Nothing? Wow! It's automatically... Yeah, it's automatically... Neato! Ah! I was wrong! Oh yeah, this is where I came down from. Nice. And I go... This way? Maybe?
Okay, but now the problem is I don't know where to go to <laughs> keep the game moving forward. Uh... Oh, probably just this way. Right? No, maybe not. Down here is this chest. Then... Oh, the icon goes this way. Oh! Oh, that thing! Right! Right! I don't actually know if I've been in this room. Oh, this is a new room! Oh, I confused... I confused this room for the previous room, and it's you again. What, what happened? A realm shift? What was that? Far away to do the shield bash. Not anymore. No, nope, nope, anymore. Sound, that sound was a little uncharacteristic of rage mode, which was very funny to me. Kill him! Kill him tonight! Are you sure we're doing the right thing? If you wish to abandon this creature, we will leave. Well, no. I don't want to abandon it. But if we have to kill a bunch of dark elves to get there... I remember a young lad whom, until this very moment, would take on an army of Draugr to save a wounded animal. But these aren't undead Draugr. They're elves. I just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes. Getting involved where we shouldn't. Aww. He's, like, thinking about the consequences of his actions, potentially. That's pretty cool. Greatest foe. What Tyr said in the temple stuck with him. Yeah, he learned he <laughs> learned real well how to get things stuck, to how to make concepts stick. Because so he was stuck in the door for so long. That's the joke. Ah! 
Yo, P okay, here's a question. For people who came from uh, from Ku's stream of this, and and I, I guess I guess you must have done it in like a previous part or whatever, but um in Alfheim I guess we're still in Alfheim, but earlier in this Alfheim section did Tyr get like majorly bugged out and stuck in <laughs> one of the doors <laughs> in a highly hilarious way? You don't think that happened? It was it was like the funniest thing in the world. For literally like entire section, like an entire section of the game for I don't know, maybe like upwards of like five minutes. He was just he was just completely stuck in between a door, and every time we walked through the door, oh. Every time we walk through the door, uh, he would appear for a brief moment, walk in a very specific circle animation, and then disappear again. It was genuinely hilarious. I couldn't get enough of it. Whoa! Yeah, and then he got unstuck for the section where you, uh, like read some of the some of the prophetic like runes in like the magic realm and we left and he was fine and then we walked through the same door and he got stuck again it, it like i completely lost my shit it was the funniest thing in the world look there that bomb should help us out. <laughs> I, I just found it in time for you to backseat me. I just looked at my game time and I'm 30 hours in this game. No show, Shows no sign of stopping soon. I wonder where I'm at right now. Like, probably... Yeah, like, oh, we like just passed 10. Nice. Hey, happy 10 hours, everybody. I know that. But I'm usually the one who drags us around trying to rescue animals. Why do you care so much? Is there something you're not telling me? No. Okay. Oh, there is. There is totally something he's not telling him. I'm so curious. Kratos, what's what's on your mind, bro? What's on your mind, Govna? Oh, I see. <gasps> And not it either. Well, maybe it was just this. You just did it from a wrong angle. No, oh, I guess not. Huh. Uh... I don't really get it from here. I don't really do anything. I'm not gonna hit it. Don't glow like I'm gonna hit it. Oh, you know what? That's probably it. I just need to get it from a different angle. Like, from up here. Yeah, okay. I love how this is basically just a dungeon with occasional puzzles and fights, but also has this interesting through line of Kratos and Atreus talking about stuff. Welcome to literally that's what the gameplay loop and appeal of both <laughs> of both God of War 2018 and this game is boiled down to a singular sentence. That's just kind of what the games are. When you really think about it. Above you. 
Oh yeah, no, the fact that the fact that this this is side content, like this is something that would be a main story level in the previous game. Don't get don't get me wrong. I, I get what you mean from that angle. For sure. I just thought it was, I just thought it was funny because I was like, hey, wait a second. That's the whole game. Whoa. Is that a nest for Nightmare. <laughs> Truth buzzing stop? <laughs> I'm so I'm so glad I'm able to nightmare post now. Whoa! Whoa! Gefune's ghost. That's the largest bloody half you I've ever laid eyes on. It's not just in pain. It's trying to sing. It's the song of the sands. They don't normally sing like this underground. Is that what's causing the storm? Aye. Judging by all this hive matter weighing it down, it's been trapped here for dozens of winters. Don't worry, Lunch. We'll get you out. Its name is Lunch and Dinner? What is that name? Well... The last squid thingy we saw was Diener, so... Oh boy. While I appreciate the attempt at humor... Lunch and dinner? ...is truly awful wordplay. Embarrassing, <laughs> really. Oh, well... Stop! ...and I'll be winners. <laughs> they, act they actually call it out in-game, too, which is really funny. I'll say, what the fuck? Yeah, Mamir, I thought that was fine. There's gotta be a way to clear those rocks. Get a better angle. You get a better angle. Shut up. I don't know anything about angles. Since when are you an expert on angles, huh? Huh? Oh. If you could, you could have, you saw that the whole time. If you could see it, why were you waiting for me to tell you what to do? Yeah, there we go. Looks like it can move now, but it still can't get out. Much of the hive matter is gone. We can free it from the surface now. Dude. That's beautiful. Why did they trap it down here? Hafgifers are known to burrow, so I'd hesitate to place full blame on our Dark Elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the Dark Elves, any more than the light belongs to the Light Elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources, one the Elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the Light Elves seem keen to banish the hive over on their side, the Dark Elves make effective use of it out here in the Barrens. So, by clearing out all of this hive, are we hurting Dark Elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved. <laughs> no. Kratos, afraid. what are you doing? Kratos is acting weird right now. I, like, I, tr I don't understand where he's coming from with the way he's like... He's asking such leading questions. He's, he's clearly like... I don't know. He's clearly hiding something about this little excursion. Oh, shit. Ew. <laughs> oh, it's one of these. Oh, it's one of these. Well, now I, now I just get rid of the whole thing. Just get rid of the whole thing. No. No more. Why is this look like why is this like confetti right now? That's a weirdly colorful snow. I'm sure that's really nice on the bit rate, but what were you doing?
Kratos always gets pretty aggressive when it comes to men or creatures being enslaved, so the weird questioning tracks. Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. I just don't know, like... I, I, maybe I missed some information. Was this creature enslaved like the whale, or, or was it just, like, trapped? It's just trapped? Yeah. This is the spot! We I don't know, this, this feels... Here. I guess this feels a little bit different than... The whale thing, I could be misreading something. I, I'm just getting, I'm just getting like a weird vibe from Kratos right now. Like with the whale, the whole time I was like, oh yeah, that makes sense. And Kratos is just trying to help Atreus think things out and also be in touch with his desires. Yeah, I, I, I also had a similar thought. Like maybe he's kind of, you know, question, like, uh, like you know, the whole game he's been like questioning his judgment, and I feel like. One theory is potentially that this is just a way for him to encourage him to, you know, think about what he actually wants to do and whether he's actually fully thought the consequences through and, like, you know, what are his priorities and whatnot. Like, it, it, this this feels like, this feels like, oh, it's like a, like maybe a teaching moment and that's maybe why he's kind of being a little weird is because he's, like, really trying to understand, like, how much his son understands the consequences of his own actions because, you know, up to this point in this game, he definitely clearly, like, believes uh, Atreus has, like, a lot of flippancy to the way he's approaching these things and these, like, you know, life-or-death scenarios, which, you know, he definitely doesn't not have that. <laughs> he's, he's been... Pretty irresponsible here and there. Oh, here it is. I mean, the moment with Freya, like, that whole thing was just like, kid, what are you doing right now? Hey! Oh my god! Oh, this was in the trailer! Sounds much happier now. And hey, the storm's gone. I remember this now. Oh my god, that's so pretty. Look, Father, thanks for bringing us out here, but you don't have to do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered he just wants to spend time with you, lad? Oh. We still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead, but if Ragnarok approaches, I wish to enjoy the time we have left. Oh, that's why. Okay. I... I don't know what to say. Thank you for yeah, it was... bringing us out here. I'm glad we did this. As am I. Yeah, we were greatly overthinking it. I think, oh my god, the reveal that it really is just like so simple as he just wants some time with him. Oh my god. That's so sweet. There's something I'm not sure oh my I god. quite understand. Look at that. In the Ragnarok prophecy Odin knows, all the realms get destroyed, including Asgard. In the version Groa kept secret, Asgard still falls. Wouldn't Odin have tried to prevent it either way? What difference did her life really make? I think of it this way. When it comes to subverting prophecy, knowledge is power. Without the full picture and context, the finer details can lead you to tragically incorrect interpretations. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain... <laughs> back, back in my homeland, there was a, let's just say, a dramatic program that <laughs> my family and I watched that really taught us these values. It was called... The, it went by the name That Soul Raven. No. Heath witches who are keen on destabilizing the government. Enough. We will continue later. As I recall, I was about to relate the story of the Heathwitch. I am, Mamir. Shut the fuck up. Deceptive prophecies. Hold. 
Hold that thought. I think it's about to get violent. It's bad! Ow! Ow, I'm on fire! Yeah, me too! Ow, I'm on fire again! Come on. Uh oh! Uh oh! Whoops! The haters have arrived. Brother, I had a thought. What? Like. <laughs> 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 I just take off like a chunk of his health, I guess. Okay. That dog. Whatever. Reminds me of tales of a cruel empress. One too angry to die. We will see. I heard you laughing from Joy's stream and wanted to <laughs> Well hey, welcome in. What did we just get? New armor? <gasps> New accessory, okay. Yeah, something funny happened. Also, yeah, something something that Chad has been discussing a little bit that we didn't talk about, um, or that I didn't talk about. A little okay. while ago, you meant. Okay, hold on. Um, yeah, yeah. Lest we forget, uh, last game at the very end, uh, on the on the wall of like the giant's prophecy, we can very clearly see Kratos in what appears to be somewhat of a near death position, if not an exact moment of death um which makes a lot of this make a lot more sense he's definitely like yeah and, and oh my god that also totally like i mean that even further i wasn't even i don't even know how i wasn't thinking about it from this angle but i wasn't until just now it totally like 100 percent like gives context as to why Kratos is really specifically totally down with not doing anything about Ragnarok or anything having to do with Odin and this whole shit. Like, you know, obviously he, it makes sense just given like his whole thing is he came to like this, this Scandinavian side of the world, like the, the nine realms to, to get away from his past and like settle down with loved ones and really just like kind of live a life of peace and like normalcy. Um, so you, you already have an inherent hesitation from that. Like add only like if you add on to that, the fact that he is now seen with his own eyes, a prophecy that if they continue chasing this road, he might die. Like, Makes a lot of sense. He's very much, he's fighting against, like, the fear of what might happen if they intervene. Ravens is by your own choice. Oh, Which so then leads me to question, like, 
he must really like hate gods <laughs> in general if given all that he still said no directly to odin's face when he said i won't fuck with you if you don't fuck with me he said no even in spite of all of that he like he he's just so not down to cooperate with that motherfucker like a lot of the sand is cleared up. he will fly There's in the face of his own uh like that means sense of self-preservation that's so funny to me yeah, yeah, and he valued Freya as well, yeah. The chisel will not open this. Did the lighthouse put this lock here? Why would they care what happens in the barrens? A fair question. But until we find the right key, that poor half goofa will have to continue its solo act. There's there's so many layers to to what the what all the characters are doing and and how they're behaving in this game that I feel like, oh my god, it's just so it's just so rich. As I recall, I was about to relate the story of the Heath Witches, who overthrew a government using only deceptive prophecies. Tokyo the Drift! Influential Thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. They dressed it up in enough details they knew would come to pass. So oh, did, you get, did you get a splinter, brother? <laughs> Next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Murders many he once called friends, too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing touch, the witches revisit this usurper. With just a few details structured ever so misleadingly, they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats. Physical, Physical or magical. Or magical. Aye, aye, <laughs> but was not so for him. All turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go. The Thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed, none dare speak it. Yeah, Macbeth. All thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy. On this wait, stay alert. <laughs> it's gonna come right back to it. I believe I was telling you the story of a man with a cursed name. Golan Cole. Ooh, new, new, new. To say before, I like your story about the Thane and the Heathwood. This is so funny. Set that aside for now. <laughs> Oh shit. That worked. So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Where they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or <laughs> probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting. Oh, they follow us. I'm uh, I'm just having trouble finding where we're supposed to collect Tears memory tokens. I don't know. I like I really want to unlock a new tier cut scene. Um Maybe if we maybe if we do a cyberspace stage we'll like happen upon one. I don't know. <laughs> what if this game had cyberspace levels that were like Excerpts of levels taken from like God of War 1 and 2. <laughs> With like the same combat style. Oh. Okay. Come on. 
on. Come on. You wanted to you wanted to bounce off for a second. I go around it's like Oh yeah, here we go. Through here. Whoop. Sort of a harp. I can play No, it's sort of a harp. I do not. And would prefer it remain that way. <laughs> Let him play the harp. <laughs> Fucking mean man. Damn. Oh shit. Easiest thing I ever did probably I ever did probably. <laughs> Another shield rond. Rond. Strike of affliction. Shield strikes against status afflicted enemies consume the ailment, causing a damaging elemental explosion. Sure. It's pretty good. I like how it's blue. It's shield run? No, they no, that doesn't make any sense. There wouldn't be a fucking Kim Possible reference in God of War, guys. That's that's so silly. Now now I know you're gaslighting me. You're trying to fucking make me think they got like Disney Channel references and like okay, yeah, it's funny, oh, but on, come on, let's get real. You mentioned you had a favorite poem from your home life. What was it about? A cunning general. A war over forbidden love. I believe I've heard of this one. Did it involve a horse that was not as it appeared? Yes, but that is not what happened. Oh, it's based on truth then. And you were there. Yes. I prefer the poem. Aww. Jelly posting. I expected a smaller voice from Amir. <laughs> what do you think you should sound like this? I'm just a little guy. I have so much knowledge in my head. Hey, don't put me down too fast. I'll get sick. It's me, Amir. <laughs> I would, I would delete the game instantly. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Those fucking 10 out of 10 scores, gone. There's the shield holding up black. It's good. I always knew Sinji was a great blacksmith, but this magical shield, it just feels natural. The shield is well made, but it is you who wields it with skill. Thanks. Oh yeah, no, Arj, don't worry. I I was intentionally making that voice as annoying as possible. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to say before. I liked your story about the Thane and the Heath. Yes, you did. You <laughs> you I said really that exactly before. Day, well, I try. Jaw tends to get sore, but thank you, lad. No, that's so sweet though. Jokes aside, this is very nice. Old. What? We we are on the sled. Old. Betrayus on his toes a little bit. I'm just imagining it occasionally 
just <laughs> scream <laughs> just to just just book him a little just to, <laughs> just to make sure he's he's alert For some attention. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you can give it as much attention as you want. Please feel free. Just keep your compliments brief. We have a lot of stuff to do. Surprised to see you out here, Sindri. You must hate the sand. Oh, it is the worst. But with Brock banned from Alfheim, it's up to me to keep you ship shape and sharp. He's dragon so shouting. You mean dragon Alfheim. posting? <laughs> oh, that's, um, I don't know if. Well, do you know what a juicy nokin is? No. Well, thanks to Brock, the elves sure do. Uh, what is a juicy... No. <laughs> <laughs> like... Oh, this game is just way too funny. This oh. axe just keeps getting stronger. But what about my blades? Spatial items. Flash forward three waves of light that it deal increased damage against enemies afflicted with Sonic? Dude, I'm inflicted with Sonic. I'm afflicted with Sonic. It's in action. My, it's in affliction. I agree. What is, wait, so this is a hilt? Is this, um, what is that? That's a relic. I don't understand, but that's fine. Let's make a resurrection. This must be from Alfheim. Explains the uh, sand. Tributes to free or tributes to re re re. Tributes to Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Tribute to dinner. Wait, I knew that better. Tribute to dinner. Good fit. <laughs> yeah, tribute to Nightmare. Man, actually, Darkdale Prison Snow Gauntlets kind of have a cool. I don't know. He looks actually. This is not. This like doesn't work together at all. <laughs> What's with all the Grinch stuff? Uh, we were Grinch posting too much, so I banned the word Grinch, but I didn't ban the ability to work around saying the word Grinch by editing what the word looks like. <laughs> yeah, he's like a, a Grinch. OK, 
okay. A little bit weird, but... What is the... What is... What is... Oh, it's him! I see. Let's see, Cole. Okay, so he's like a... a Grinch. If it isn't my two favorite customers... and Mamir. Hey, Asin. Why, why, why so mean to Mamir? Why so mean to Mamir? Did I miss something? I assume stuff like Grinch posting is a meme that means posting about a topic excessively? No. No, that's that's not it at all. I mean, specifically, I and chat uh, keep referencing the same fucking, like, 20-second video about a guy pretending he's reacting to the character of the Grinch for the first time because I think it's the funniest thing in the world and I can't stop thinking about it. Here, let me play it. So he's like a, a Grinch. <laughs> okay. A little bit weird, but... Oh my god. No fucking way. He's actually awesome. <laughs> No! Dude! No! He's so cool! He's so cool! He's like a character- he's a character that he can- Oh my god, I I- That's actually awesome, dude! <laughs> <laughs> that's actually awesome, dude! My, my favorite fucking thing in the world is, um, okay, a little bit weird, but... Grinch. <laughs> okay, a little bit weird, but... Oh. <laughs> oh my god. He's actually awesome. Dude, no. He's so cool. And he's like a char he's like a character and he can... Oh my god, that's actually g awesome, dude. <laughs> Let's see if we can get any more, um... Mimir, I know this sounds weird, Armor from the Can you crows. tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul. And every soul has four parts. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the Lake of Souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light. So that's where Fenrir is? The Lake of Souls? So long as his soul still has its direction, aye, it's well on its way. Dude, all dogs canonically go to heaven. Huh. Blueprint for you. You what? Oh, cool. Like Anything? The of all, we swung from the tree. Wisdom gained father, servitude gained we. Swung from the tree. Like father of all, we swung from the tree. Wisdom gained father, servitude gained we. That's awesome. That's a really cool little little stanza. Nothing. Damn it. Why did we even come here? We could have stopped at Zaxby's. Now we don't have time. I'm so fucking mad. What'll it be? Alright, let's go. Odin hung himself from a tree? I didn't know that. <laughs> I 
He did it to gain wisdom while also impaling himself. Damn. Well, I hope Tears had enough time to find his equilibrium or whatever. Indeed. I saw flashes of the old god of war in them, but they were fleeting. There is nothing wrong with opposing war, nor opposing prophecy. <laughs> oh, yeah, fair. you'd say that. Never can be quite sure what the giants meant by any of it. Am I the only one that remembers they predicted our entire journey to Jotunheim? If the giants saw Tyr leading armies at Ragnarok, then I believe them. The question is how you'll ever make Tyr believe it. What's this little guy? So, this whole spectral squirrel business, you can shoot out your feelings into little ghosties. I suppose that is a slightly inelegant way of putting it. These spectral versions of myself are aspects of my personality that I often find distracting at best. My ability not only lets me cast them away and provide some temporary peace of mind, it oh. also lets me to see what goes on outside the tree. Why not just go look yourself? As the eternal caretaker of the tree, I may not leave its confines. All part of the deal, but worth it for the immortality and such. My spectral form still allow me to see the outside world, albeit through slightly colorful viewpoints. That's one word for it. That bitter form of yours is a nasty piece of work. I'm standing right here, you know, lit freak. <sighs> I'd apologize <laughs> for him, but where would it end? I think that's the long and short of it. Safe travels. <laughs> yes, we'll be moving along to other things now, you hulking dingbat. What the fuck? Is hey! <laughs> Don't talk to me like that! Does Bitter say anything about the chimes? Perhaps there was some confusion. This is I don't for think calling so. me Damn out it. here, not for when I am here. Hey, you say mean things to me. One more time. Yeah, that's that's what you'll get. Okay. Um. So I actually think I'm gonna stop here for tonight. I feel like actually this game has been breaking itself up in a very convenient set of like four to five hour chunks <laughs> that like make it really easy to find stopping points, which is awesome. I don't know if that's going to last the whole way, but um, so far I'm enjoying how structured it is. Um, yeah, this, and this seems like a good place to stop as any. I'm sure we'll find some crazy new character revelations and whatnot uh, next time. Um, speaking of next time, I don't know when the next time I'm going to stream this is. Um, I I feel like there's equally a chance of me streaming more of this tomorrow as there is for me streaming anything else. So just keep an eye out. I'll let y'all know what I'm doing tomorrow, if I'm doing anything tomorrow. Um, and then, uh, sorry, my throat is like in a way tonight. Um, and then we'll just, uh, you know, we'll just keep winging it until Pokemon later in the week. Um. I don't know if Pokemon is going to be a midnight release. I'll have to look that up and see if anybody knows for sure. Because uh, that would definitely help give me an idea of like what my plans are for Thursday. Because uh, if, if it comes out Thursday night, I might start on Thursday. Um, but we'll have to make sure. Pretty sure it's a midnight release. Yeah, Switch games. I think the, the bigger Switch games more often than not are, um, are midnight releases. So... I'd say that's it's a reasonable bet, but I will I will make sure. And then um yeah, otherwise, like I said, keep an eye out as to uh what's going on tomorrow uh, on my Twitter and such. I'll I'll let y'all know. Um because it's it's I mean it's either gonna be more of this or some one off like 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 I mentioned Pentiment at the beginning of this stream. Um, and I'd like to try that. I don't know if that's going to be a stream one, though, so we'll see. Um, <clears throat> until then, though, uh, please do take care. I'm going to send you all over to Dollop.
uh, if you wanna if you wanna hang out, cause you know she's gonna be going for the foreseeable near future. So, and we know the raid we know the raid phrase is gonna be Grinch posting, right? Grinch posting. So yeah, go go say head of dollop uh, in her. Uh, on day two of her No Pokemon Left Behind stream, please feel free to hang out. The vibes are super chill in there. So uh, y'all are bound to have a good time. Um, and again, I'll see y'all soon. Set this up. Take care. Please be good to yourselves. Treat yourself if you haven't in a while. All that good stuff. I, I, I hope you enjoyed uh, stream tonight. I certainly did. Um, I fucking love this game. I can't wait to play more. Oh my God, I'm like obsessed with it entirely. And I hope you're looking forward to tomorrow as well. Um, I'll see you soon. And until then, just uh, have a good one. Rest up. Bye. <laughs>